going to be singing Hyde. Wow, that's awesome. That's awesome. That's really cool. That's so cool. That's really cool. And we're live. Hello, everybody. How's Hi. it going? Hi. Hi. Hey. Well, sight. <laughs> well, you just like phased through half the ship. That oh, that was awesome. Yeah. All right. That was a Welcome. cool party trick. Welcome, everybody, back to Former Course or Saturday Survival or whatever I pretend to call it this week. Um, so we did it. We got this ship. It was it was so easy. It was <laughs> such an easy little job, Captain McGill. Uh huh. So nice. But we got it. It's in well, mostly I... one piece, and uh, and we even managed to bring back the poor, forlorn, beaten up wants to cuddle which somebody just tore apart one of those nasty nasty pirates must have been a really he must have like had a name that only had two consonants or something he was just a bad person <laughs> <laughs> no anyway. <comment. laughs> anyway stream how you guys going oh hey we've got a uh, got a whole bunch of people in chat already Huaco. We've got Lancer. We've got O Gomez, or Gomez, Gomez. He just joined our Discord. Wow. Well, welcome to the stream, wow. and welcome to the Discord. <coughs> or do you like a banana? Oh my gosh, there's legs, and there's a taper butt right above me. I'm not gonna look back up that way again. Anyway, so uh, today we're just gonna. Uh, whenever Miguel shows up, we're gonna get this thing off our hands. So. Um, we can poke around it, I guess. Look around, see what's going on. Uh, I know Cruz got his, uh, was it like another cruiser in there? A cruiser? Um, yep. <laughs> a cruiser. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you, Scarlet. Thank you for the $2. I appreciate that, Master yes, Scarlet. Thank you. And hello, Severed Limbs. Hello. Oh, and Severed Limbs is here. Hello. Oh, all our favorite people are showing up. Our friends. <laughs> um, but yeah, so. Well, let me, uh, there oh, any sound sorry, problems, hi, either. BB. We love you. No, no, uh, okay. we don't. I love you. We apparently. don't love BB. No. <laughs> <laughs> Especially after all the work we. Uh, uh, no, BB. It, it's it's good to have BB here too, of course. And BB is saying quiet because he just doesn't want to be in charge anymore. <laughs> the nope. poor man. The poor man. Uh, uh, and Jeray's bouncing off people again. Um, anyway, so today we are joined by, as we mentioned, BB. Hello. Creator the Clang Boy. Oh my gosh. Hello. Drago Lord 19 Delta, who is floating in front of my face. Somebody locked me in my cryopod, yes, last week. I don't know what you're what? talking about. <laughs> uh, Final 57. Hello. Jeray. I'm who's, lost in space. He's drifting off that way, yes. Um, Nabarine, of course. Hello, everyone. <coughs> Freaky smile. Yes, I hate that smile. <laughs> and Tabor underscore 14. <laughs> Baby wants to punch me in the faceplate. Hello. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure Captain McGill's going to show up at some point, and, I'm, and he, as always, is voiced by the wonderful and talented Master Scarlet. Yes. Hello. <laughs> Sorry, I broke the magic. There's no magic here. <laughs> There's no magic here. Anyway, uh, so let's go. I mean, we can. What do you think? I should we poke around the ship that McGill wanted so bad? You can. I'm gonna go be productive. Okay. And help uh, my friend Jeray. Eh, why not? And then you might have I have better coffee than the, the we've got in the. And, and oh. BB, uh, I have a special assignment <laughs> for you. I would like yes. you to uh, to repair this ship. Someone broke it. <laughs> no. I would like I would like you to fix it. Do you want me to repair the jump drive? Uh, the, no, not not the white ship. I'm talking about this black ship here. The cuttlefish. Oh, this one. <laughs> yes. Okay. Somebody Bibi. broke it. Um, I'll work Bibi. on it this stream. Maybe I do. Want me to try I... and iron out some of the uh, wrinkles in the armor okay. on this ship. All right, all right. Any, anyone else got anything I need to work on? Well, I mean, like, no, BB. I was Good. thinking about um, adding like a pyramid or something. <laughs> a pyramid? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, for those of you who are not in on the joke, BB has been building a one-to-one -one scale pyramid in survival with no jetpacks or large grid vehicles, no flying vehicles, um, in a 
with a bunch of other uh. people, and it's been it's been about a year. Uh, tomorrow's the one year, and they made a big push to get to get done, and they're almost there. Yeah. Um, we all we almost. all participated in that earlier today, and I'm sure something is going to show up on his channel at some point about the pyramid, and I'm very excited for it because uh, he's worked really hard on that thing, and he loves it and he hates it, and it's <laughs> it's wonderful. <laughs> Did you see how many people showed up? Yes, it was crazy. Yeah. Oh my Our gosh. Discord was hopping. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're there to support you. Oh. Yes. Let's see. Uh, chat. Who else? Oh, we got Zerinia's in chat. Hello, Zerinia. Um, <laughs> Scarlet. <laughs> BB. Scarlet suggests uh, repair it. All I heard was use warheads to straighten out the spine. Good man. I'll get started. <laughs> I don't like you, Scarlet. <laughs> Thanks for the money. We don't like you. <laughs> I don't like you in the most in the most thankful way possible, in the most grateful way possible. Um, but yeah, this shouldn't take. I'll, I'm I'm obviously gonna help fix this thing. It needs it needs some needs some good fixes. What's up, Drago? Oh, I like that. Um, Let's go. I'm I'm reading these little LEDs. Uh, Symptoms. Yes. Sores, internal bleeding, right? Death yeah. <laughs> down in the. Death. Um, is death a symptom? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in the cryopods, yes. It's a side um, effect, I suppose. <laughs> I think we may have a plague sip. Everybody off! It's the corona. Everybody get off! <laughs> Wait, they've got I'm, corona I'm, on I'm, this ship. <laughs> Wait, they got booze here. Oh, booze. Jeff. Deal with this. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> Definitely got to get rid of this ship. <laughs> well, I'm glad we're not keeping it. Yeah, it's not ours. <laughs> not ours. So no grindy not grindy. Yeah, Zerinia, it's the beer ship. You're correct. It's the beer yes. ship. Why didn't you call me? <laughs> 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 okay, I'm going to go um, get my welder and grinder and things and then... Get I'm just using I... my welding ship without any components loaded. To just iron out the uh, armor. <laughs> Make it look a little better, yeah. That's not a bad idea. <sighs> I'm gonna go scrub myself down what with some. What the heck just <laughs> happened? <laughs> okay. Rocks. I was COVID not that close to the ship. I think I just got. Yeah, ship. Well, I think I just got vaporized for no particular reason. I mean, uh, this Again? I'm sure there was a reason. <laughs> like I was flying, t I was flying toward Nickadoodoo, and then suddenly I was against the side of Nickadoodoo. But it had, <laughs> I was not that close when it happened. Well, Nickadoodoo loves you too. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, I think the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and fix this cockpit. Oh, somebody already did. What a pal. <laughs> Fix. What happened to the cockpit? How'd you get it back? Uh, no, I final just fixed it. Oh, he yeah. was override, uh, he's, uh, dragging it. Whoa! What just happened? I don't know, yeah, I was, I was manually controlling this ship at the end of last stream with the override controls to get it out of here, or to get it out of there, and then I stuck it to the side of that flagship. Fuck, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> A random nap death. Is Splitzy here? <laughs> oh, man. Tabor. I lost the welder. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> okay, I'm moving. Uh, we need more steel plate. Yes, we do. Do we need iron to do it? Do we need a king? I'm checking right now. Hmm. There we go. Should be easy to repair now. Oh, let me make sure I've turned. We got a little bit of iron, but oh no, we got 18k, 20k. Refine, refine. No, never mind. We got 536k. We're good on iron. Just needs to be turned into steel plates. Yes. Yeah, we have zero steel plates. Well, I will quickly start. You are not. <laughs> Salud. Or Gazoonheit. Oh, Pardon. <laughs> Lancer says, Splitsy, did someone burn to death? 
Uh, I'm kind of glad Splitty doesn't watch these streams because he, he, I think he would be a bit put out. <laughs> hey, Kabak mentioned taking his frustrations out by shooting us in the face in their last video on Splitty, That's true. So. He, he did say that. Yes. I, you know, I do hear that shooting us is quite therapeutic. <laughs> don't do it. Nobody get any ideas. I don't know. What do you think, <laughs> Ray? Is, is, is it, is it therap does it feel good to shoot Nab and myself? <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. Shots <laughs> fired. No comment. You have some of the starfish. We're a loving community. For anyone who doesn't know why we're poking fun at each other like this, um, when we do our PvP battles, we fight each other. Um, whoever doesn't make it onto the stream team is the opposing team, and so uh, a lot of the a lot of our normal uh, our normal Flight, flight buddies and wingmen uh, ended up murdering us a bunch last week. It was uh, it was a good time. My favorite is so like patrons get first right of refusal, and most of the patrons are like, "Yeah, we're gonna kill you all." Like, yeah, that's, that's what they want. They want we're to kill to us. Kill you. Yeah. <laughs> well, or when we're playing other games like Deep Rock and. <laughs> Yeah. Hitting each Tabor, other. You everybody in the back in deep rock, yes. so that's just this thing, yeah. <laughs> See, I don't discriminate. <laughs> My aim is equally bad no matter who I play with. Had a stressful day, life got you down, just shoot DE in the face. <laughs> not in the face, not the face, please not the face. <laughs> not like it's a moneymaker. It's your voice. Don't shoot him in the neck. Don't shoot me in the neck, please. <laughs> My voice isn't my moneymaker either. My moneymakers are my hands. Huh. And my backside when I shake it. <laughs> it's a party in the back. Kind of like Nick and Doodoo. I do not have a moneymaker. I'm mullet. just... I'm just gonna deafen myself for a... <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Aizen. Hey, Aizen. Welcome to the insanity. Hmm... <laughs> That's putting it mildly. <laughs> it looks like the ship is pretty much back up to speed here. I appreciate all of your hard work. I know, uh... Did you think about what you've done, baby? <laughs> he's like, yes, and I want to do it again. All the time. <laughs> he's, he's probably putting a warhead in it right now. <laughs> <laughs> All, uh, all joking aside, I really think that this version of the uh, of the the cuttlefish or trash or squid or whatever whatever we're calling these ships, I think this thing might be like the peak version of it. We just have to you know like switch out the weapon systems with whoever people want because it's actually relatively cheap and it can get this thing can dish out some punishment and it's shielded. I think this is a, a pretty good little combat corvette here. When the shields work. When the shields yes. work. Yes, when the shields yes. work. Yes. I mean, when, when the, the other team isn't. Is it is they're cheating! They're cheating! They gotta be doing something wrong! I, I go back on the stream and I listen to myself. I'm like, man, I sound like a. Uh, no, I can't say 14. Uh, an 11 year old, 11 year old boy who's just having a bad day. Oh, sorry. It's all good. We've all been there. We've been there. We've done that. No, no one took anything personally. Yeah, it we're was, all, we're it was all a friends lot of fun. Here. We're all friends. Yeah. <laughs> we all love each other. Stop! Stop! No, we well, really do. We love each other. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Jeez! <laughs> Welder called in my face. A bag of mixed nuts has suffered limbs. <laughs> I love that Scorpion Core's nickname for us is caught on. Yep, we are the bag of nuts. What you up to, you bag of nuts? <laughs> he just comes in stream one morning saying that. <coughs> I'm printing me a uh, ready and forward. Cool. Yeah, I'm just doing a bit of a fly around. The uh, wants to cuddle and just 
welding like, up any blocks I can. It looks like most of it's uh, doing pretty good. Turn that off. Turn that off. Yeah. Do we? My need... welder sparks every now and again. Do we need any uh, any resources? Or are we doing okay? I think we're okay. Choice will go. <clears throat> I think this is the first stream where we don't really have a goal. Oh! Energy McGill inbound to the system requesting an inbound track to your location. We're just gonna have to invite him here. So everyone make sure the guns, all turrets are off. On it. Uh, On the big dog. Hello, Ortiz. <laughs> Good to see you. Gatling turrets off. Mikadoodoo. It's looking okay. <laughs> Nope. Well, I saw weapons fire. Scary. Someone hit something. But you don't have to apologize for missing streams. That's not a thing you have to do. But no. thank you and welcome back. <coughs> I think I've got all the turrets off. So for Why this can one, I not this con There we go. Turrets all, on the compound. All turrets on Nickadoodoo are offline. Uh, Same snake dog. Okay, what about um, wagon bucket? I guess she doesn't have any real turrets that can reach anywhere. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna give them. It's dark, so I should have gotten everything. Those point defense turrets on her can do a number on characters. I'm gonna give him the GPS to the to the area here. GPS, where is it? Uh, new scrap her location. Rename. Great American Space Base. Yard. <laughs> Simple smash and grab. Am I right? <laughs> <coughs> ha. 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 <laughs> What the? What the what? Did you guys see that? What? No. See what? USA message drone? No. I did not see that. No. You guys don't see that? I see that. Where? Oh, yeah, I see it now. 46 kilometers out. It's uh, coming towards us. Um, oh, yeah, I see it. Do we have a special message? Uh, can, uh... Dre, you want to go check that out? Yeah. Take a, take take a ship take, uh... or a soup or whatever. Let's go see what it is. It looks like it's moving. <coughs> I'm on like, my way. We're like right at us. Thanks, Dre. I'm following you, Dre. Okay. Uh, 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 we need a ship with a couple seats. You don't have to. I can ride on, on the window. <laughs> All right. I'll just take the uh, blue welder ship. Okay, inbound to you. Copy that. All our defensive turrets are set. As I be you want to down. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm off. Uh, what's RTC Civ Abignil Adams? That's them. That's him. That's uh. I'm gonna bring. Alright, I'm just gonna have him come right over here. Uh. Okay, never mind. I think it. Oh, A Abingail, not Abigail. Abingal Adams. I keep on writing Abingal Adams. Magical Blabbums. Who is this guy? Captain McGill. He's the guy we've been uh, we've been doing business with. He sold us all that platinum for ice. Oh, platinum, that's, a, gold and that's stuff a, that. ship. Yeah, it's a ship. Yeah, it's a ship. It's He's a ship's in. name. What I'm gonna do? I'm actually gonna go ahead and propose peace to his faction. Um, what is he? He's. RTC? 
see factions. Correct. Rogue traders. I'm gonna propose peace with the rogue traders. <laughs> rogue traders, not pirates. Rogue traders. Caution, rogue traders. <laughs> Reminds me of the rogue robots. That's, that's exactly what it was. That's what it was. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna fly out to meet him and ride in with him. Severed limb says it's a trap. <laughs> Isn't our, everything? Our, uh, it's a Cylon ship. I mean, if anything, it's a trap for him. Have you seen what the Nicodudo can do? <laughs> yeah. It could do even more if it were optimized. What if Captain McGill just wanted the plague that's on that ship? <gasps> it's a bioweapon! It's not even the ship itself. Right. And I can't even get coffee out of it. It's <laughs> <laughs> it. it a little pony. Slow. Oh my word. What? He's got a torpedo on this ship. <clears throat> He's got a couple torpedoes on this ship. Oh. Um, he's Can we got buy a, formic, a formic ship on his ship. Formic wreckage. Excuse me. Uh, now, where did you get that? I'm, Makes me I uncomfortable. Kind of want to talk to him. I'm gonna walk up to. I'm gonna walk up to his bridge, and I'm gonna see if he can. Little is he in there? Let me in. Yeah, he's in there. I was like, what if he's not in there? Now, I see him. Go ship. Formic spies. Hey, how'd the mission go, guys? <laughs> um, <laughs> simple, <laughs> simple smash and grab, huh? Yeah, you snuck right in, right? The coordinates they gave you were spot on to that uh, old. That old docking pylon, right? Yeah, 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 it was spot on. There were a lot of angry people inside that station. You know, you can come inside if you want. Okay. Well, you I don't just wanna... to float out there on the... There were, uh, a lot of angry <clears throat> people on that station. Oh, it couldn't have been that many. <laughs> well, at least four. <laughs> at least four. There were at least four of them. Yeah, but there's like 16 of you guys. <laughs> Not that many. But as you can see, uh, Dead I overslept. Is the ship. <laughs> yes. Yeah, she's is... she's looking pretty good from here. Uh, yeah, I mean, she's in great shape. Really and truly, mm -hmm. she is. Like, <laughs> mm. the we have some questions about the interior. We but... do. We do have some questions. Uh, lots of things referring to symptoms and death and sores. Corona. And well, she she was on her way to a to a colony to help us. On her way to the colony with a whole bunch of sick people. <laughs> with pre-logged charts. <laughs> hey, look, I didn't fly the thing. I was just hired to escort. Uh huh. Okay. And you. Lost it? Yeah, yeah, I did. I, I lost it. I mean, look, look at this awesome. ship. The Three ship six. I'm flying does, isn't exactly a warship. Someone yes. comes out of warp with something with a lot of bigger guns, and they tell you to bugger off. You bugger off. <laughs> you know, I uh, I did notice you're carrying a couple of torpedoes today. Yep. Yes. Yep. And a formic. Is that what that is? Thing big... thing tried to jump my ship. Hi, Karamba. <laughs> I used to have I mean... three of those torpedoes. <laughs> well, apparently they work well. It was an expensive choice, but I think I'm worth it. I, I think you <laughs> saved yourself a whole heck of a lot of trouble. That's what I think. Yes, there's a lot of a lot of gnawing pain. I'm surprised that. You have not been contacted by the government as we have been. Well, he his uh, he doesn't have the industrial base we do. He's got he's got a respectable little 
private trader here, but it's not, uh, she's no Nicodudu. Uh, yes, that's true. Oh, and there's uh, BB. Hi, BB. Looks, looks like there's some holes in the, in the nacelle back there. Ah, uh, it's all, uh, cosmetic damage. <laughs> One of the jump drives may have been sabotaged by someone. Uh, on our way out, we we were have fighting a running battle all the way out. I'm just gonna pull up alongside her. All right. Oh man, we got a pretty good view from this bridge. I will say, not not too bad. I like the uh, the lack of block sight lines, you know, except for the port side. Yeah, well, you can't have everything, right? Um, Dre, this drone has a remote control on it. I can set it <coughs> to a GPS location back at base and just have it fly itself. Works for me. It just... Oh, it's probably already locked on to that, but let's get a, let's get a hold of it. Alrighty. Is, you, is there, uh, have you guys accessed the cargo of the drone at all? Is there any message inside? No cargo. Just the connector and it's empty. Okay. Is there anything with text? It honestly looks more like a uh, kinetic torpedo than a message drone, but you know. Well, that's, that's just uh, me. Whatever. We found a message <laughs> drone coming into the system here. Is the message uh, death? No, I'll, uh, I'll take a look at it. So, what kind uh, of message drone you guys get? Uh, it's from. Looks like it's from the Navy, uh, Captain McGill. If you'd like to look over your 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 ship here, um, I know we were promised a, a fair amount of payment, and I understand that uh, she did take some damage, and you may wish to adjust that payment as uh, as you look through the damages. But uh, feel free, take your time. Let us know if you need anything. I'm gonna go take a look at something that I may have dropped. We need more iron. There should be 500,000 uh, iron. It's not refining. It's, no, it's already re refined. It should... It's not... Well, nothing in the production. It says I have zero available in production. So... Let's see. It's refining... Gold, lots of gold. Don't gold, turn lots on of gold, lots of gold. Gravel, nickel, silicon. Yeah, I'm not. Uh, there's iron. Why? It's in assembler five. Okay, I'm gonna come back over to here and take a look. But yeah, you're uh, you're pretty yeah. lucky that this guy didn't tear you up. This formic here. Uh, I think he may have been damaged already. Yeah. Uh, he wasn't maneuvering very well when uh, I let that missile off my cargo. Yeah, I wouldn't want to get hit by one of these things. They're, uh... It's still ex... powered. It is? Oh my yes. gosh, it is. It's, uh, it's watching. Make it's sure there's no antennas active. They're it's watching. Areas. It's got a single battery. Uh, McGill, I'm just gonna go ahead and turn the battery off on that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we don't take any chances when it comes to Formix. We've had some yeah. rough experiences with them. Oh, they're mm -hmm. so creepy. They're so creepy. There was a guy who used to be in our party. He sounded a lot like you, so this yeah. is kind of weird. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so the uh, damage yeah, that... Whatever happened to that guy. I don't know. <laughs> we don't, we don't <laughs> like to think about it, so... Um, he had a Did habit like of not... Some? <laughs> he had a habit of just not sticking with the group. <laughs> Anytime we had to Was go it? somewhere, he didn't, uh, he didn't really show up. He didn't up. really come along, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like he magically disappeared somewhere. So, when I was going through this ship, and people were shooting at me. It was very confusing how there were no signs anywhere. And uh, I don't know if you know who the shipbuilder of this thing is, but uh, if you do know, remind me to never buy any ships from that company <laughs> because there's no signage. 
pretty sure it's a government contractor. Uh, probably. Uh, uh, biohazard. Infectious yeah. material use yeah, of hazmat. I'll, I'll just stay out of that room. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to go this way, too. I'm just going to... Wow. Just, uh... Looks like the pirates stripped some of these rooms down to nothing. Yeah. I went ahead and locked that door for you, that biohazard room. I appreciate that. Alright, we can, like, talk to or get a control of this, uh, message. Tr I can control it through the, uh, if you can, If you can just get it over here, I'll take a look at it and see if maybe there's something. I just made directing sure. its remote control, but it wouldn't accept the input. Ah, nice. Here we go. Um... Try now and see if you have better terminal access. Oh, we can we can access it through the terminal. It's just the autopilot. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna oh. try this hacking thing. Done. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Had to change the flight mode. So, uh, what's your, what's your gut is, feeling, yeah. McGill, on the, uh... uh on looks the like the data is still intact. I would have preferred uh, some physical samples of the medicine, but I'll take what I can get. Physical samples of the medicine. I don't rec recall you saying anything about medicine. I recall you saying something about get the ship. Well, I assume that the uh, pirates would have been too foolish to mess with the stuff on board, but I must have been wrong. I'm betting they took it on board their station. Do you know what the medicine is for? Uh, it was a vaccine, I believe. For whatever it is that they were quarantining people for? I mean, that, that's what I would assume. But you know what happens when you do that. Just gonna seal this ship up real quick. Looks like that message drone's getting closer. You guys managed to get a hold of it and control it? Yeah. Yeah, I, I've got a, a GPS point um, that's real close by, and I've set it up so that it will fly to the uh, general shipyard location near nearabouts, and then uh, right into the base. Okay, sweet. I think I can pick it up from here without slamming into anything. Yeah, same same stuff you use for your call to. Let's see. Oh, hi, Black Phoenix. Welcome to the stream. Sorry, we were doing a little, a little bit of our roleplay stuff there, so I didn't look at the thing for a while. It's gold. Someone is sniffing in the mic. Needs to put push to talk on. Um, okay, I will. I will address that next time I see it happening. Uh, close calls. Okay. We got one episode of this season. Archangel, you never. Okay, no one ever has to feel bad about not catching. An episode of of this we understand that all of you have lives and uh that a bunch of uh, a mixed bag of nuts on the internet mm -hmm. playing around pretending they're space space people uh space may engineers. be lower on the priority list than other things in your life and that's totally fine we're just here having fun and hoping you guys have fun too he had asked earlier what he had. No, 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 no. So I was trying Crew. to figure out what to tell him. Crew. The thing is, it's piloting itself. Don't interfere. It'll, it'll freak out. Uh, uh, did these uh, disconnect on purpose? Uh, yeah, that's uh, that's your payment. I'm just gonna move my ship away and uh, lock oh. onto that. I feel like I should probably not be here when that uh, that signal drone shows up. Oh, uh, it's here. Here. You know, me and the Navy, we don't exactly have a uh, solid past. Okay, well... That's reassuring. <laughs> well, he's, uh, he's taught... He's been pretty straight with us, so I'm okay with it. It uh, looks like it's all here, looking looking pretty good. Uh, I, I, I took a little bit of stuff, because uh, it's going to take me some resources to fix that thruster in the cell. Yep. And uh, some of the um, internal damage, but it's mostly there. Yeah, and then just a, just a friendly suggestion. Take that formic 
wreckage and dump it into the sun. Or the lap of somebody you don't like. Yeah, don't. I wouldn't even. I wouldn't even do that to my worst enemy. Okay. Uh, do we have some tugs that can come grab the, this cargo? These cargo pods here. Uh, I think I can bring something. Yeah, we've got three cargo pods. We need to connect them. They're slowly drifting. Um, see All right, where is he, doctor? Where is he nearby? I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay next to the cargo. Check out my signal. Is somebody going? All right, maybe? see ya. I'm docking the message drone onto the uh, shipyard. Okay. Ooh, don't. Oh, don't shield! Shields shield off. your shields off. Turn your shields off. Shields are down. Okay, you have a warship, not a tug crew. Go, go after, go ahead and go after the one that's ri yeah. ricocheted. I'll, I'll that. hang out with these two. Okay. Um. All right. Do we have that? Uh, that doodad, the message drone, here. Yep. Where is yep, it? Yep. It's stuck. Stuck to the uh, shipyard. Okay, coming up. Uh, look and see if it has a secret pocket. I can find it. Oh, I found it. The oh yes, it was here the the whole time. There is a data pad in here. Let's see what this says. It says notice. Due to your failure ah. to protect the Ansible as contracted, United Space of America forces took significant damage in recent battles. You are required to send at least three destroyer class vessels to the Invictus system in three weeks time. There you will meet with USA forces and attack a Formic supply depot. What? It will be heavily defended. Expect the replacement Ansible to be online within the month. Admiral Graf, United Space Navy. Oof. A supply depot? What do they consider, uh, destroyer class? I don't know. I'd consider Nick a doo -doo to be. Uh, we're bringing Nick a doo -doo. Like, there's. After the <laughs> mess of last time, we are bringing Nick a doo -doo. Okay. Um, we've got Bad Dog. So I guess we finish this ship. Um, and hopefully it's close enough. I mean, it's uh, at least three. We could probably. Once we get cruise Nick ship done, we could pull a couple of these. Uh, the, I'd have to classify that Nick a doo -doo is bigger than a destroyer. I said at least. Yeah, it's like worth having two or three ships by herself. Yeah, that's true. Well, we it's like a heavy cruiser to me. It. And they'll be overjoyed. Mm. Every we'll 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 talk about that as we get closer to the date. But I think what we do need to do is get this ship that's in dry dock done, and then print off a few more uh, of the the trashy squids. And I did find out through some uh, simulation testing that uh, multiple fixed light lasers, like four, four or more fixed light lasers, do significant heat damage to shields and can chew them up pretty bad. Especially so if you have a bunch of those focusing fire on a single ship. There's a lot. Yeah, of I got a bunch of uh, uh, turret light lasers. Uh, what's what do you want done with? What do you want done with the message drone? Um, I have no plans for it. So if you want to play with it, you can. If you want to break it down, that's okay too. It looks familiar. Like it was featured in a TV show or something. Let's see, uh, Paul Drive says, I would say Nika plus da Bad Dog plus as many squishy squish. They're not squishy! <laughs> Unless they don't have shields as possible and have them all shielded. Decoy drones as Waco. Nice, Dre. You've got one, in one on each claw. That's awesome. Okay. Um, so we they're got a whole bunch of They're actually linked slugs. to each other as well. We got a whole bunch of railgun slugs now. Uh, McGill? Yes, I did say that was from Graf. Good luck with that guy. I'm out! Oh, oh no. <laughs> well, enjoy your plague ship. Oh, I'm 
so glad that ship's not here anymore. So I'm guessing the uh, thing to protect something was... Uh... That was the Ansible satellite uh, like a month ago. Yeah, we'd gone up against some yeah. forms. When they had some kind of shield-piercing laser. Yeah. BB had a bad day. And I couldn't just... I could only tickle them. There's nothing more I could really do. We were we were undergunned. I do not want to have be in that situation again. So we got a whole bunch of railgun slugs now, and a bunch of space credits, some power cells. We got I think we got 600 railgun slugs. That is pretty good, actually. memory serves, down on that planet there was a wreck with a bunch more railgun slugs in it too, so if we wanted to get more if we needed to, we could go down and grab that, but for now let's get this ship on the road here. What road? On the space road. There's a space road, right? That's a thing? Is yeah. It a country road? Oh no. They, I think they take <laughs> <laughs> You've done it. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> To the face. How long? <laughs> space Virginia. You don't <laughs> Space Virginia. <laughs> Mountain. Paul, you Asteroids. Space, 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 mountain. space mountains. <laughs> okay, guys. <laughs> don't you mean asteroids? McGill outbound from system. Good luck, Same Space thing. Cowboys. Um, Paul. You don't have to apologize if you call them squishy squids, because without shields, they are very, very squishy. Um, but yeah, this one's not squishy. And right. so are we. Uh, the insides, yes. Okay, let's get this thing going here. So we've got some... Ugly bags of mostly water. Let's get these reactors done. I think these are the most resource-intensive things these going so if you are not uh if you're not doing anything let's get this ship going crew are you still laying down blocks yep okay try and get a cac uh, together what components do i mainly need for construction uh steel plates motors computers uh Reactor components, superconductors, large steel tubes, construction components, steel plates. It's the, the usual suspects. Well, I'm talking about just to start off with basics for getting the... Oh, for uh, your little, your hull, little Calda hull, thing. Um, if you want to start well, with to stuff... to load up into my Calda, yeah. Yeah. If you want to start with stuff for the, the ion thrusters on the outside, that'll be probably pretty good. Alrighty. Should also place some gyroscopes so they can start being produced. Yep. Well, welded. For makes know how squishy human are. Thank you, Huaco, for that. And that's why they like us. Reminder. Um, um, um. They like Boss, you want to take this uh, credit and deposit it into your account? Uh, sure, I'll do that. And the next time he comes back, we can give him right back to him and buy something. Or we can uh, relive Mara, somebody go kill him. Uh, and bad my business. signal goes <laughs> off. It was a thing, okay. No, I wasn't. Uh, it was, he ran into my grinder. He oh, ran into my, my grinder, grinder nine times. times. Nine times. <laughs> he ran into my knife. Ooh, Nab, there's an elite uh, uh, rifle for you. I'm hoping not to shoot anybody today, so I'm going to leave it well, right where it is. <laughs> today, yes, but, you know. <laughs> not today? What happened when I said that? We didn't, we didn't kill, we didn't hit any of the ships. Not today. Can't remember what that was. That was in this, in this series. Okay, we've got 144,000 space credits now. Not making enough construction components fast enough. Human the other white yeah. meat. We uh, actually, uh, when we visited Jure not too long ago, we went to a museum all about cannibalism. 
<laughs> yes. It was fascinating. What a choice. Well, it was the Museum of Man, and it just happened to have that as their special. <laughs> their specialty? Well, it was, that's, you know, moving. Museums typically oh, have a moving or a rotating uh, exhibit, and that was what was on rotation there. Bag of disturbed nuts. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Sounds about right. Okay, it looks like we're out of reactor components. Let me see what we got for production here. Let's see, can, let's go to assembler three. Reactor components. Yes. Um, come on. What are you out of large steel tubes? Three. Um, how much uranium do we have in the fleet? I think we might need yet yeah, uh, catch up. Uh, let me see. We may need we may need to make a stop at a uranium. We need more plant. iron. We have about three hundred uranium spread out on the Nicodudu. We've got, uh, we've got a lot of uranium on ships and that are docked to this ship. Looks like two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, uh, sixteen, eighteen. We've got, we've got like two thousand, maybe twenty-two hundred uranium over here. You can come skim some out of these reactors if Nicodudu's a little low. Our right, we'll considered a happy meal. Yes. Yeah, we've got plenty of iron. Do, we, do you want me to build some more assemblers? Get some more uh, production? I can do that. Uh, let me check. I'm looking at it right now. So it was cool. We'll need somebody to iron mine. Now we have tons of iron. We're good on iron. Okay. It's just not there. It's not. Uh, no, it's, it's just not there. It's just. The 12k iron? No, we've got 500k. Oh. That's like three levels of pyramid. <laughs> <laughs> pyramid on the brain. I mean, because everything that we're making right now requires straight iron. Yeah. Let me see what's going on with maybe the conveyors or something. Or That's what I'm thinking, because there, there used to be a whole lot in Assembler 5. I'm almost... I almost want to just get rid of the conveyor sorters because I feel like it has something to do with that. The conveyor sorters on the uh, what's this? This is shipyard. An four. <sighs> have only been set up for the. Uh, oh, I see what's iron. going on. I can fix it real. Okay. Yeah, the iron is going into like one assembler instead of. Uh, I got. Yeah, I see what the problem is. The, the uh, assemblers are full of other stuff, so they're not pulling it. Yeah, that happens. Design flaw. King! Why do I keep hearing myself echo? Don't know. Is somebody using their speakers? Uh, I'm not. Headset. Or have very very powerful open back headsets no just is it on stream yeah, well, yeah I've, we'll i don't know if it's on stream i assume it is because <laughs> Waco, we can't clip nab here that's funny there are ways to clip youtube yes there is we have ways of making yeah. talk All right, who's assembling, uh, real gun? Uh, we just got like 600. Yeah, so I'm trying to figure. We don't need from... to assemble any real guns. We don't, we're not assembling any. I don't think so. 
No, some popped up. It might have been a few left over. Uh, no, that's from which from the cargo container which I just transferred from. Oh, thank you, Master Scarlet. Another another donation for the fleet. Thank you, sir. Through super chat. I love that we have super chat. Super super chat. Super All chat. Super chat. Right. We should be sorted now on the uh, super chat uh, assembly. Hang on. Super chat. <laughs> I heard myself echo. I'm I'm staring intently at Discord. Who's echoing? I'll sing a song until we know. I'm gonna catch you. We're Maybe gonna you catch too. it. It's not us because my microphone is going through his. So okay, that's enough. I'm irritated now. <laughs> Yes, but maybe one of your voices is going through the other microphone. It's that's not how. Never mind. Well, <laughs> don't worry I about don't it. Don't know. That's, not that's impossible. It's not, it's not true. <laughs> that's impossible. That's not how it's working. Like sometimes when we're on Twitch and we are each streaming our own perspectives, that is what happens. But yeah. in this instance, it is not. Okay, I have just built us four more assemblers. I'm going to put them all into cooperative mode. I've gathered 800 excess uranium, and I'm putting it in the Nikadudu. I love how anytime I sing DE's like, Okay, shut up now. Oh, <laughs> I just have to say it because it irritates me so much. <laughs> You, you don't think that uh, a tuneless... No, that was irritating. However, yes. it happens every single time. <sighs> okay, guys, I'm going to need you guys to build me a couch to sleep on because I think Nab is kicking me out. <laughs> Why would I do that over something so me. silly? She hates me. There's, there's a couch on the lower deck. <laughs> okay, thank you. I think if you continue with this trend, we might need to build a coffin. <laughs> Oof. Uh, Hawk Trackerson says, don't take the debate to Oh, and thank you, Black Phoenix. Some cash for a bit of iron for, uh, for NE. But thank you, Black Phoenix. Appreciate it. I hope the girlfriend doesn't hey. sleep on the couch. We run out of foster components. I'll put their cold feet on. <laughs> That's his thing. That's BB's massive issue. <laughs> oh, no, no, Nab, you have hugely cold feet. I know that. But this has never been a secret. Don't all worse. women have cold feet? I think most of us do. I think most women have very cold extremities, and I'm not sure what that's about. I think most it's women because are our lizard circulation people. is... <laughs> You're here. I don't know. Down with the lizard people. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right, kicking him. Let's see. <laughs> Boss, I'm going to go mine some more uranium so that way we have a plentiful stock. Sounds good. What are you doing here, Drago? I'm building my ship. <laughs> so. <laughs> Thank oh, you again, Scarlet. Scarlet. Oh Scarlet says, try my couch, DE. It's super effective. <laughs> Scarlet's couch is like an item from the Odyssey. Like, <laughs> they, they had to, like, keep Odysseus away from it or he would never leave. So... Uh, for those of you who don't know, there is one time... There have been multiple times. <laughs> multiple times. But Scarlet was going to do something with us. Uh, because he often plays the bad guy and or helps out with things. I think or does was, activities. Or does activities yeah. with us. And we're, uh, I messaged him. I was like, hey Scarlet, you ready to go? Scarlet? <laughs> Scarlet? <laughs> Scarlet? And he had actually given me his phone number at the time, so I text him. I'm like, Scarlet, everything okay? Did the couch claim you? <laughs> And like three quarters of the way through the stream, I get this sheepish text message. I fell asleep on the couch. I'm sorry. <laughs> it is. It's his couch. It's anytime he's not there, we're like, well, fell asleep Cou on the couch. Couch got him. <laughs> couch.
Lost stories. Love that song. However, we can't sing too much of it. Yeah, I know. Yeah. There it was again. Stop. It's you. It's you, Drago. It's you. It is him. <laughs> is it? It's me. Yeah. Maybe it bleeds over when you talk. I yeah. Well, so he's on push to talk right now, and so anytime he has his his talk on. I can hear jumping. whoever it is that's talking. Yeah, Drago, are is your Who's jumping? Headset? Who's jumping? Me. Okay. Dre, he's gonna go get uranium. It's I, want to get I uranium. almost got a miner too. He made off with all of our space <laughs> space credits. I can't just rob us. You are on a roll tonight. Thank you, Scarlet. He's, he's trying to make a donation war. I don't. But like, <laughs> don't. It doesn't work like that. I don't think. I think he's just he just wants to have everybody see oh my gosh the, the formatting on that got messed up <laughs> it says it's so comfy mm -hmm. I have fallen victim to not only my couch but also my truck's driver's seat many times wow just fallen asleep you must have been quite tired it's a good seat I don't know, it I can is, pretty much like, sleep anywhere. It's a comfy seat. That's a man thing. You're a man thing. To be fair... I'm a I've... man's thing, I guess. No. <laughs> no. You're definitely what? not a man's thing. <laughs> Thanks, I appreciate that. I'm very glad. You're very, very <laughs> welcome. Uh, I was about to say, uh, <laughs> to be fair, I fall asleep in the, in the bed of my truck as well, so, you know... That's impressive. That's impressive. Running low on silver. Uh, sort of, yeah. I'll grab some. Um, okay, thank you. While I'm not here. Has the uh, has the parts bottleneck eased up a little bit with the four extra assemblers? Some speed modules on there. We're not producing what we want to produce. They're just in cooperative mode. Yeah. I think that's amazing. I'm gonna throw some speed modules on him. How did you fall asleep on a canoe, Hawk? How did you do that? How did you do that? Booze. I have done that as well. A canoe? <laughs> it rocked gently. I can see how that happens. Yeah, I, I laid down in the belly of the canoe with it tied to a tree and just fell asleep. There was rum involved. Okay, all right. Never mind. Questions are over. I understand. Uh, there was no rum involved with me. That I was. I just fell asleep in the in the canoe. I fell asleep. <laughs> I, I can sleep in a canoe. Canoe. Uh, <laughs> canoe. Sleep in a canoe. canoe. <laughs> I am so funny. I was making puns earlier while I was helping BB out with his pyramid and Pudding was like, you've been married to DE too long and I'm like, you have no faith in my punning abilities. What is going on? It was pretty punny. I, I was punning long before I got married to DE. Yeah, her dad's pretty punny too. Yes. There's a reason they're called dad jokes. Why is this one yellow and the other ones are green i've also yellow. fallen asleep on top of an engine block energy low <laughs> it's because, it's... because i was that purely was because i was so exhausted i just fell asleep laying on top of an engine block midway through my work wow yep batteries are disconnected so i was perfectly safe to be Doing that, but it, it's still, you know, <laughs> odd. <laughs> Someone woke me up. I was like, "Why am I on an engine?" <laughs> well, cause you fell asleep there, friend. That's what I. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, then that's confusing. If that's the reason why, 
I don't understand how these ones are operating because nothing they're connected to is technically online. What's operating? Well, so there are uh, conveyor tubes, right? Um, that are online. And then there's one that isn't. And I thought that it, like, my initial thought was, of course, it's because it's connected to reactors that aren't online, but these things don't seem to be connected to reactors at all. And so I am, I am confused. But it's SE, so I will remain confused. It will never stop, and that's fine. I have accepted my fate. <laughs> um, where is this nap? On the uh, ship that's being built right now? Yeah, it's over here. Um, it, the one that's yellow? Yeah. It's because it, it doesn't have a connection to a further inventory. The ones that are green have connections to inventories, which the thrusters are included in that. So, basically, if things are or can go through the tube, it is green, even if it's not connected yes. to power. Uh, I think this grid is powered. Well, yeah, the grid would be powered, yeah, otherwise it's it powered. Yeah. It's powered, but it's not connected to the rest of the cargo system. Yeah, any junction, any basically where once the yeah. tube is at an end point, whether it's a junction or another conveyor system, then it's considered valid. So because they're connected to those junctions, they're green. They are valid. But yep. that one is not, but this is a junction. It's... Forget it! Doesn't matter! It's stupid! I don't care! I'm not, going back to It's not stupid, it is consistent with the rule within the rules of the game. But it's still not it's because I didn't see where the other junction. ones are. It's connected to a junction on one end, but it's but without the completed reactor, it's effectively open on the other end, which is why it's yellow. Okay, it so it can't both go ends through the reactor. have to be done. No, gotcha. it just can't go through the reactor to the rest of the conveyor network. Um, not what we're talking about, D. Fine. Whatever. Whatever. The reason why the... The emissive is yellow. Yeah. That's what we're talking about. And it's going to okay. an unfinished... Cargo-capable block. Which, okay. in this case, is a reactor. Okay, so Lancer says, I once worked with a guy who literally face planted into his meat pie mid shift. He was so tired. The meat pie was partially eaten with ketchup. Okay, so, uh, have I got a story for you? <laughs> oh no, not the pie. Oh boy! No, story not time! Not the pie story. So, when my father was a boy, he refused to eat his vegetables. And my grandmother was very upset with him and told him, you are not getting up from this table until you eat your vegetables. Never dare dad, kid. <laughs> my dad didn't eat his vegetables and his vegetables and they forbade him from leaving the table. My my grandparents went to bed. They came down the next morning and found my father asleep in his mashed potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> They oh, they great. woke him up, cleaned him up, said, fine, you win. <laughs> and sent him off to bed. <laughs> oh, no. What, oh, something that? exploded. What's blowing up? Lost my welder again. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, you want for me to build even more assemblers to be in cooperative mode? Because I can I will totally do that. I will build all the assemblers. I will make BB's yeah, that's, base jealous. That's hey. acceptable. Hey! <laughs> Unfortunately, BB, we have the resources to do that here. And the inventory capacity to do it even faster. I don't know. Pudding can share mine a lot. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, but we can carry an assembler in our pocket. In this one. <laughs> Cause I've got an assembler in my pocket. Is that an assembler in your pocket, table? Or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> Lancer, happy I'm to see you. I'm confused as to how this person is still alive. But I'm sure other people are as well. Are you in a crazy story about sleeping when you shouldn't? I had a friend of mine who fell asleep while riding his motorcycle. Oh no. Oh, wow. 
twice. Twice. How do you survive that. Pure dumb luck. Dumb luck. Like I understand that motorcycles are very stable when they're moving, but still. This welding ship's a death trap. You just figured that out? <laughs> Which one? You have to, like, get close to the welding pods in order to get into the ship. Yeah. <laughs> Most of us have that way. Oh, well, usually you don't have them on while you're boarding. I do love that it's brilliant blue and glittery. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm reading a chat. <laughs> Was it narcoleptic or diabetic? Just an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got. I had a buddy. He uh. He he had a motorcycle, and some lady hit him, dragged him about a hundred feet. Dang lucky to be alive. Motorcycles scare me. Motorcycles. Hey, they're fun. You know, until you decide to play a Superman or chicken, whatever you hit. Yeah, I mean, so, like, responsible motorcyclists are... It's actually pretty safe as long as you don't have people who bad things happen. Um, I mean, my brother, my brother had a bad experience with a motorcyclist. He was, uh, he was driving his car and the cars in front of him locked up the brakes he did his head check there was nobody there pulled over and he was doing he and the rest of the traffic was doing around you know 25 30 miles an hour so it wasn't that fast so he wasn't too worried about anything and a guy on a crotch rocket hit him from behind at 75 miles an hour um, uh, went up and over my brother's car and died on the pavement in front of him um, while he was calling 911 trying to help him. Uh, the the police exonerated him, saying the guy was going way too fast. This particular individual also had uh, opiates in his system and fortunately did not have any family, uh, any, well, any kids or anything, but had, uh, you know, and his, pa his parents actually contacted my brother and were like, hey, just let you know, we don't hold you responsible for what happened, which was incredible of them to do and it was a, yeah like i don't think they realize how big of an issue it my was. my brother didn't want to drive he yeah. was like i'm never driving again yeah but it's it's so important like anyone in control of the vehicle like the am amount of energy involved it's so important to just be aware of your surroundings um because you never know who you could save by doing that and it could be yourself could be somebody else yeah, usually. Yeah. If you're in a car, it's usually somebody else that you're saving. We are out of yeah. platinum, question mark? No, it's still loading. Okay. Yeah, I was uh, pulling out from my uh, high school, and I was actually driving my father's F-250, which is a large truck. This guy just walks right out in front of me. I'm going uh, 35 miles an hour, and luckily I did the brakes earlier that week, and I was able to stop before hitting him, but... It was close. Yeah. yeah. It's, people are scary when they drive. Did you say we needed silver as well? Um, I, I think, think somebody we will, said that. Somebody said that. Let me check. Um, I'm yeah. seeing some silver, but it's not that much. Uh, yeah, we got about 10k silver, 11k silver left, so we could use some. Okay. How about okay. uh, how about gold? Um, uh, look. Pretty oh, good. Should... But, yeah, we could always use some more. So he was on foot, walked out in front of you, so... <laughs> we could use both silver and gold. D We've got e a little bit now, but go D ahead. He and I were, um, driving with the kids earlier today. Um, and there was a dude at a crosswalk who just didn't want to wait for the crosswalk sign. Uh, and walked into oncoming traffic on in an arterial road. 
um, and just expected people to stop for him. Like, they were so shocked that they couldn't even, they didn't even honk. Like, they were just like, what on earth is happening right now? It was the most terrifying thing I've ever seen. Yeah. I unfortunately have a motorbike story that also involves that same truck that is not... Not fun. Nope, 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 nope. Yeah, not fun to read. Think of, not fun to think yep. about. We're such a happy bunch. Eh, we are real, which That's is... A, we are for deal. real. But, yeah. Fossil tubes out again. What do you mean you can't pull them? They're right there. My goodness. <laughs> I literally opened up the assembler I was looking at and pulled out the small steel tubes that told me it couldn't have. <laughs> that, that's keen. That, that is keen for you. Oh my gosh, Lancer. Wow. <laughs> oh. Lancer, Lancer, you're my favorite viewer this stream. Oh no. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> There were dad jokes being made in the in the stream, and and he goes, "Only if he's a parent, otherwise it's a faux pas." Uh. <laughs> Face paw. <laughs> you have elicited the cackle. Mm. <laughs> Most people in our state, Paul, wait. Like wait. that's yeah, wait. wait. They actually do. Like, and we get made fun of it. Uh, me, yeah, we get made fun of for it, where we actually wait. Um, because like if a like we, I used to have a teacher from New York, and he came over and we were on a field trip, and he's like, "There are no cars coming. Why aren't we crossing the street?" And we're like, "You're an adult. You're supposed to be a good example. What are you talking about?" And he was like, "Why don't you cross the street?" It's like because it's still red. We're not leaving. <laughs> crossing until it's green um but he was like that's unheard of that's ridiculous if there are no cars then you walk and it's like no you wait until the green man and then you walk <laughs> um yeah texas they write tickets yeah yeah yep. so anyway we it's not that it's just there are individuals who believe that they are more important than everybody else and so or stupid. completely invulnerable. Yeah, or invulnerable. This guy, I'm not sure what his deal was. Like, I legit think he was stealing something, honestly, and was just trying to get across the road. But yeah, he was holding something in his hands. Yeah. The world is crazy, man. Yeah. I've seen, I've seen some pretty crazy drivers. Uh, one guy was just driving faster than the posted speed limit of 70 miles an hour on the shoulder. When he met the bridge, it was um, not a pleasant sight. I imagine that it wasn't. Yeah, the little sports scarf is, uh, don't float. Something shields are offline. Yeah, I, I see that too. We call that's those that's people a... temporary Australians. <laughs> that's only if you see them walking across the road on their hands, though. Oh, that's why some things shields are offline. Somebody moved my ship, like, directly into another ship. What the heck is going on here? Okay, hold up. You call brakes anchors? I've never heard this difference in dialect before. Brakes on what? I think on his car. Very funny, BB. Very funny. I've heard him referred to as binders, but never as anchors. <laughs> um, there was one fella that came in and called it the uh, squealing thing behind my wheel. Because he never replaced the brake pads. Yikes. But you're supposed to? <laughs> <laughs> he also didn't have a rotor left. Uh. 
Speaking of breaks, I need to make an appointment for your car, Diggy. It's true, I know. It's so true. What's with this car? Just needs better brakes. Yeah, needs yeah brakes. this just needs to be replaced. It's, it's just time. It it, yeah. it needs brakes. Well, it's got brakes. It's they're just um they're just getting old. Like me. Old man. Psh, please. <laughs> Looks like we got one of the reactors done. Well done. Well done, well done. Ah. And you can see that pipe that you were looking at earlier in Aberdeen is now green. I have I have steered clear of that area of the ship for quite some time because I'm angry at it. <laughs> She's like, I have moved on. I <laughs> She's past this now. <laughs> but thank mm. you for trying to help explain, and I think I understand... I just, I, this game annoys me sometimes. <laughs> sometimes? Most times. <laughs> Let, let's be honest with ourselves. Most <laughs> of the time. The heck? Why is the, why are the tempers not working? My favorite was when I was, I first decided, oh, okay, what happened? I don't understand. The dampeners aren't working on one side of the ship. Oh, I bet you know what's going on. Um, the first time I decided to stream my own solo game of Space there Engineers you know. on my Twitch channel, I was finally able to just ask questions with everybody's undivided attention. <laughs> and, um, I was like... Okay, because I've never built anything. I've always built everything in survival. I've never built anything in creative. And so I was doing yep. one of the survival um, things, and I'm like, okay, I'm piping things up, and I know things have to be piped, but this is a battery, and there's nowhere to pipe anything. And they're like, oh, just put things there. And I'm like, I hate this game. <laughs> just put it on the battery. It's fine. Like, it'll just work. What? <laughs> the batteries don't need fuel. Why would you need to pipe a battery? <laughs> you put batteries. Never what, mind. What battery needs a pipe to it? Explain <laughs> this to me. It's, I think it's ridiculous that you can just slap a battery on and it's like, oh, I'm fine. I'm a happy battery. Put anything on me and I'll power it. Like, I just. Like, that's ridiculous. Happy battery. <laughs> you just well, have to just. Happy little battery. <laughs> I think uh, what Nabreen was thinking was thinking of having to wire the batteries yeah. yep. I, that's exactly into the what ship. Thinking, yeah. And saying is Nab needs to play Starbase. I was just thinking that, yeah, Starbase. Oh. <laughs> you get to wire everything. Good, at uh, least it makes I, sense. <laughs> Welcome to another uh, Starbase video. I died from a welder. Again? Scarlet agrees. Says that, that uh, Power cable cables should be need a to thing. be a thing. Yes. Since that's what he does. This yes, yes. Or at least make it so that they only extend so far, unless you, you know, say from like junctions and the actual power source. Yeah. So that you have to I, run yeah. pipes. Or yeah, because it makes no sense to me. Like it for me, it's like, why would I ever use a reactor then if I can just power anything that this battery is attached to? Uh, because the reactor generates yeah, much the more battery power. will run out. I understand this. I understand all of the little things, but if I'm not using it for huge amounts of things, then to me it doesn't even matter because it's just using like it's for this one purpose. You guys have all these grand schemes of I'm gonna use this ship for this, that, and the other thing and it needs to be fully optimized. And I'm like, I'm trying to build a thing that goes. Let's go. It's called redundancy. <laughs> <laughs> Never in you assume I plan. <laughs> Let's put a block here. Oh, and we'll extend from that block, and here's another block. Yes. You can tell she blocks. really likes the game. <laughs> Me think the maiden doth protest too much. I'm not. I'm not protesting at all. I'm saying straight up, I <laughs> this game. Thought you were protesting. A not a game. Part of that for a second. Ah. <sighs>
I have fun playing with you all and I appreciate that it is fun for you guys. But to some people, this is not their idea of fun. <laughs> you? For a lot of uh, people in the, who share my same way of thinking, this game, like the idea of a sandbox game in general, actually, I've noticed this, that like the sandbox games in general can be difficult for some people to swallow. For me, I think it's, it's the idea of there's, there's no... Clear objective. Yeah, like, and that's, it kind of bothers me because it's like, well, if I, if I wanted to create things in this world, then I suppose it would be fun, but none of the none of the things in this kind of world I don't build rockets like that's not my thing I will build a house <laughs> I will build um, I will build a defense system from zombies I will you know like I but I don't build rockets that's not my thing so I weld things together and I run and I mine things, <laughs> and I'm a helpful person. Well, it kind of you shoot me. things. I do um, shoot things. I shoot things very well. Yes, I do. It kind of reminds me of like what I do when I edit. I do a lot of things editing manually because I don't know how to do a lot of the stuff that's automated. And like, I just watched a video the other night about uh, 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 Bezier masking, and like my entire world has changed forever. <laughs> I'm like, wait, that's a thing I can do with this program? Like, there are so many actual, like, special effects and things that I could have been doing in Deadly Salvage instead of using the, quote, practical effects of space engineers. And I'm like, man, <laughs> all this stuff now, but I don't want to do much more because, like, the best thing I had done up to this point was the, uh, uh, like the jump drive, the jump flare when they, they, they do like the Battlestar Galactica jump flare in and out. Um, I like it. Which almost <laughs> looks like it could be uh, part of the game because the flare looks kind of that same sort of hokey cheesy animation that Space Engineers does for its jump drive stuff. But I am, oh man, the things I could do. And we bought we bought Vegas Post with our uh, tax refund, which is basically the Vegas version of uh, Premiere plus After Effects. So we'll see Ooh. what that does for me. I expect a great thing. No, no, please don't. It's okay, DE. I only expect things. <coughs> that, that's much better. I'm much more comfortable with that. Feel free to continue to expect things. The Nickapoopoo kit. Can we not call it the Nickapoopoo? Can we call it something no, else? No, please. Well, we could call it the Nickadoo, too. <laughs> no. Oh, no. Are we still. All right, coming back with gold, uranium, and silver. You know what other game that has no defined goals, Nab? Hmm. Seven Days to Die. No, there is a goal. Survive. Yes. That's not a very... Quest. <sighs> Get quests. Go Finish quests. Do that Make thing. money. It's still very sandboxy open world. Not particularly because you the more like the more I you survive, think, the more I you think work. The you... reason you like it is because there's not a lot of engineering in the game. It's literally just Don't get... even no, stop. No. What? No, 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 no. What I'm It's easier to find an objective there. What I was going to say yeah. is that there are those tiny little things where it's like if you build and you do this and you do that, you gain skill points you can become proficient in something you gain points you become stronger in these other games where that is not a thing i literally have nothing i am working for so i for me that's kind of like i don't care there's nothing for me to care about or to feel like i've achieved it has uh, nothing to do with the engineering perk points that you get are in your own brain yeah Yep. 
and my brain is going, well, I'll go brain somewhere else. So. <laughs> that works. <laughs> I'll go write a space engineer script. How about that? Not like the scripts that y'all do, but dialogue. Uh, yeah. I don't do scripts. <laughs> uh, I I I'm, I used to do script some scripting, but energy low. That was many moons ago. Soon I'll learn how to script. I now just assume by him. like is that like at least two years so. so you know what this if this is really gonna be a a, a Nika uh, design we have to give it a mast when we get it out of here you know that right it, oh yeah definitely yep pre World War Two dreadnought pre dreadnought. I mean, we could we could mix things up and put the mast underneath. Oh my gosh, there's so many. This thing's gonna have so many guns. Holy cow! Time to add more guns. Gonna be another absurd gun platform. Gunboat. <laughs> gun. The U.S. Hey, Navy formally that requests that you ship yeah, that your ships be commissioned and produced in. What? You cut yourself off there, Dre. I was saying the USA is going to sit there and request that we produce our ships in mass to become part of the. <laughs> I don't think anyone can mass produce a Nikadoo. Shields? Who needs shields? We'll just shoot at them so fast they can't kill us. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, mm, Say hello Nikadoo. to my wall of bullets. Nikadoo is not quite that powerful. I mean, she's close to that powerful, but... Oh, we're gonna make it that powerful. <laughs> Hawk says, can't make the mass bigger than Nick Nickadoodoo's. It might make it feel less of a ship. <laughs> hey, uh, D. Yeah. I, um, I think I caught something from that plague ship, so I think I'm gonna turn in early. Okay, well, uh... Quarantine. Hope you feel better. Hope you feel better soon. Don't get the don't get that death symptom. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm, 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 I'm keeping an eye on. That. All right, y'all have a good one. Thank right, you. If you night, want, baby. we can cook the pathogen out of you with a welder. <laughs> yes, yeah, sterilize myself. See you next week for pyramid. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. I think he's already gone, but like, <laughs> probably, probably said pyramid. He was probably like, no, <laughs> not <Just> again. <laughs> <laughs> as, soon, as soon as she said pyramid, he was just like, got up, just got up the computer, yeah. gone. I gotta go get a drink. <laughs> Don't know if it's alcoholic. Oh, punk. <laughs> oh, punk. <laughs> Definitely going to be able to intensify the forward firepower. My goodness. Substantially. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm going to go get myself a sip of water. I'll let you watch Nab in the meantime. A sip of water. Can we? What? Can we adjust the gravity field on the bad dog? Cause it's way larger than it needs to be. Uh, you are welcome to do whatever the heck you want with that ship. Just don't blow it up. <laughs> so, uh, 
boxes. Where is the firepower of this? Oh, wrong universe. <laughs> I, I don't know. Nicodudu might be able to take the Death Star. You know what? I, th I think just one of our small little, little scout ships under all that cover fire would, would be just fine. Wouldn't get back out, but it would get in and do the job. Probably. I mean, our sim speed's starting to drop a little bit here. How am I not dying with zero energy? Magic. Magic. world yep I imagine so considering how many times we've hit oh. everything under ah it's much better I just deleted everything under five PCU and suddenly the world is snappy and responsive again let's see how long that will last Probably not that long. So as long as crew doesn't ram anything with his shields, we'll be okay. As long or as Drago doesn't, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. I figured out what was going wrong about that. Uh, you the, have that's less than half the operator. breaking thrust that you need. <laughs> I mean, no, actually, the. Th Problem was that script I told you about the one that would let me refine my ship if something happened to my cockpit mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. was messing with the how quickly I could re the um, thrusters. So whenever I tried to slow down, it was trying to speed, speed me up. up. Yeah. Wait, do you manually slow down? No. Well, I was manually slowing down, but the script was trying to speed me back up. So I just, if I don't use that script again, I should be good. Fair enough. And as long as the people keep the beacons on, with enough space to... Oh, good night, Black Phoenix. Thanks for, uh, night. thanks for stopping by. Always a pleasure. How's it coming on that gold and silver, Jure? I'm trying to dock, but apparently this thing didn't line up. Uh, it looks like you're lined up. Yeah, you're, you're locked. locked. On my screen, I'm not. Uh, I think you're desync. Oh, like. there you go. D, we we were looking at the wrong ship. Oh. Womp womp. Oh, this ship down oh. here. Okay. Yeah, that would do <laughs> it. Yeah, he's locked now. Yeah, I brought a like a hundred and something k silver, gold, and I don't know how much uranium, like a hundred and two hundred k or something. Thank you, sir. So much flashy lights. On where? Just everywhere. Spinny ah. lights, spinny lights, spinny light, flashy light. 
it, it really does, like, if I, if I just look at it, all the people welding, it really does look like a shipyard. I mean, it is a shipyard, but... That's cool. It looks like an active and productive one. Yes. Should we move it out of its uh, out of the bay so then we can see easier or no? That's okay. Oh, you want to see more easily? Hang on. Yeah, there's some areas where uh, when I was flying my ship around, it was a little bit, little bit tight. How the spotlight uh, icon on the block looks nothing like the spotlight anymore. It's still the old <laughs> spotlight block. Yeah. The gravity generator on the bad dog has been turned off. Okay. What do you mean? Turn it off. I just, I... just hit something. That's all. Yeah, it was messing with things, so I just turned it off instead of messing with well, it. Why well, I already had just. Brain lag. A little better on the being able to see. A couple spotlights on there. Yeah, a little bit. It's looking more like a ship. Get Paul. Although he's probably gonna die anyway because they get one hit on that thing and it's going down. On what? Um, he posted a pic the picture of that of the man standing on the very top of a skyscraper, um, smiling at a camera. And uh, it says no one, and then people who play Seven Days to Die. And he's just standing on top of the thing. Like a big steel beam. The top of the skyscraper. Uh... So many clicks I make with this middle mouse button. So many clicks. Clickety clickety clack. A few more. There it is. Last large Ooh. reactor is up and online. <laughs> Sweet. Just got power. Now we just need to work on the large thrusters. We'll need a med bay as well. We would put the med bay in the CIC or just put it in an adjoining room next to it? Um, probably going to put it next to it. Okay, I will. Here, I'll start placing blocks now. Good night, Waco.
Building, building, building. We are building a lot. Yeah, I've been I've been trying to stay in engineer mode for way longer than I really am capable of. <laughs> do you need to go do some backflips in space? Will that make you feel better? Maybe. <laughs> I'm just trying to focus on just like one thing at a time. That can be difficult. I know. I know the struggle. <sighs> Well, if we're gonna do, then we could do do here. Oh, oh wait, there that now, I guess. To do what? Uh, I was gonna, I was gonna make the floors wood. Ah. Uh. Um, just in the command deck. Nothing but the finest mahogany. <laughs> Break it down. Break it down. Are you kidding me? It's a handguard mahogany. I think our shipyard's going pretty well here. Just so you know, I will not be opposed to making the ship as glamorous as you can uh, have it. <laughs> That's okay. When you're not looking, I'll just change everything to me and make it very glamorous. components I think we probably just need try to try to start uh, filling in some of the whole spacings uh, you're talking about just making it uh, airtight kind of yeah um, I would say be careful while doing that because that's how we ended up with a whole bunch of silliness on the bad dog yeah, let's uh, yeah. let's get all the systems installed. Rest your components over here. Oh my goodness! That was a bit of a chunk. Yeah. A little bit. Medical rooms online. Okay, so we have these modded conveyor junctions that work much better than these armored ones, uh, and they can yeah. do. Yeah, you can replace those. Yeah, fun. that's, that's yeah. what I'm doing. Just to keep the lag low. Yeah. <laughs> De. Hmm? Message for you, sir. I got Lancer's comment. Yeah, I'll be right there in just a second. I gotta line up. Not every ship needs to look like it escaped the Sydney Mardi Gras. Nope. Uh, you're wrong, sir. <laughs> Besides, I've never, I've never been to the Sydney Mardi Gras, so um, I don't even know what that looks like. So obviously, I can't make ships look like that. You have been to Disney parks when they're Mardi Gras. Yeah, wasn't that big of a deal. <laughs> Nobody. Lots of purple, lots of green, lots yeah. of glitter. I didn't see any beads. Come make warhead. What about oh. a warhead? 
go. It's all piped up now. Who's second out of forehead? I don't know. I thought she said kinetic warhead. I was confused for a second. That's what I heard. I said could make a warhead, but I don't know. No. Hmm. Make giant uh, fireworks. It works too. Who's more the idea the little ones are little and round and could be seen as beads? But. Kind of like I use them as ornaments on my Christmas tree. Yes. Uh, let's see, I want some cat blocks. The ready and fort lives. <laughs> I'm so Again. happy for you. Everyone, watch out behind you. Make sure he's not there. I was gonna say something, but I forgot what I wanted to say. <laughs> so, Alchemy, technically speaking, we both also really like Sea of Thieves, which is a sandbox game. However, there are goals and things to do. There are goals in Sea of Thieves. Sea of Thieves. Get Stop. money. Buy cosmetics, make more. See goals. Yes, there are goals. Ah. <laughs> oh, O2. Oh no. Oh no, power. They could, they could do in time. No. Just get in the, uh, one of the oh. miners attached to the, uh, base. I'm all good. I'm all good. Made it to the Nicodito in time. Let's see the fucking spot. Stop it now. <laughs> Someday, when you are older, <laughs> you will be hit by a boulder. Uh, what? <laughs> oh no, he doesn't know. <laughs> I heard a fall. Not gone, said seagulls. Stop, Stop it now. now. <laughs> I heard you say a boulder. <laughs> yes. You'll be hit by a boulder. It's part of the song. Someday when you are older. It's a bad lip reading. He doesn't sound pleased. <laughs> I'm just half asleep. You can go if you need to. I think we're all a lot more tired than we are normally. I feel like. No, I'm fine. Okay. I'm doing great. Don't you tell me. That's because you're know. wired. I mean, I'm wired. He's directed energy. Ah. 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 Mastic. Mastic. Mastic is better than bacon. Cruise lost. Better than bacon. <laughs> Crew has just completely lost it now. Bacon. Bacon. Making pancakes. Making bacon pancakes. Mm. Oh, tomorrow Sunday. Tomorrow I'll make pancakes for breakfast again. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't bake it anymore. Bleh. Bacon. Mmm, heresy. <laughs> no, well, just... There's health reasons why people wouldn't eat bacon, but... Uh, no, mine's because I don't. The smell brings back memories. Yeah. Mm. 
someday when you are older. Now You'll be hit by a boulder. <laughs> Bus. Okay, so I'm trying to make this interior work. You should have let me do the interior. I would make a, a very maze-like. Oh, no, 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 no we're no, good. We already I'm, have mazes. I'm trying to make it amazing, not a maze. Energy low. I am what about an amazing maze? You got me there. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> got him. How many batteries does this thing have on it? Uh, none yet. Uh, I'll add some later. We'll have to get a battery bank in there. So I've got the, uh... Yeah. I've got the start of the, uh... Medical bay slash catwalk areas in the back. I'm gonna place some up front. Like... So. There we go. We still got an hour left. I know. You get all this stuff done. It's gonna be great. Mm-hmm. You're a party pooper. <laughs> We're all tired except for you. <laughs> it's because I didn't stay in the pyramid world for twelve hours. We're it wasn't quite twelve, Is but how did my character end up on the <sighs> You fell asleep, <laughs> Timber? Um I'll yeah, I'm not surprised. <laughs> uh, you're not the first person to suggest that. I don't know how good of a film it would make. It would make a terrible film. You know why? Because there are no good films anymore. <laughs> what what was he suggesting uh, for a film? He wants us to pitch Deadly Salvage to a film company after its completion. No. It'll be remade to its potential. <laughs> Tabor's on, on board with me, like, absolutely not. They're gonna break it. Yeah, they'd... You don't want the Michael, uh, Why Bates did to you do? put that there before we drive it up? Um... <laughs> like... I'm just gonna park my character. You were, you were so I don't go up from the top sailing off into the okay. cosmos. I think... I don't know. Like... Our script, making that into a film would be very different. Um, and I think even just, e like, even if we wrote the script ourselves, um, without any other help, I don't think even you guys would be, I don't think you'd like the end result. You guys would be with, like, no, it's not Deadly Salvage, even though it totally would be. Like, it's really hard to explain. Um, but that's just the nature of changing something from one medium to another. It it has to change. Um, the Hollywood actors would bork it. Well, no, it's not even that. Like Artemis suddenly has like a holographic body and is all yeah. sexed up like Cortana. I'd be like, no, I withdraw my consent. <laughs> even if even <laughs> if we had major control, like because um, I have, I don't have a film director per se education but I I do have directing um, as part of my resume I have directed short films before even if I if we were to write it all to direct it all and even lend our voices and DE his acting capabilities like I feel like um, trying to compress seasons yeah, yes, one turning one. Turning Three the into story, one hour. Yes, so we need to we need to talk salvage. to Amazon. Is what we need to yeah, do. <laughs> make an Amazon series, a Netflix series. Um, but they'd be like, why can't we swear? So the, <laughs> yeah. I'm why like, can't we swear? Why can't we have token minorities and in, inserted well, everywhere? Why can't we have blood spurts? Why can't we? Can't we? <laughs> I mean, the, I I just. I would love to have people have faces, though. 
Yes. I want them to have faces There so are a bad. few scenes that we had, like, this would be great for backstory, this would be amazing, and, and we, we can't, just can't do them. We can't do them. Yeah. Because, because Space Engineers has one face. Yeah, one face, well, and you it's two faces. Well, yes, but yeah, two. you can't. We got we managed to ring three out of them with the old man, but um, I don't think that. I mean, it's so hard. Even like I work really hard to get those minute little like switch, like they'll look a different way or look up at just the right time. I work really hard on those little minuscule things to try and add some kind of emotion <laughs> to those characters. I, I don't at all. Um, oh well, like, you do. I'm just better at it. <laughs> Which you have admitted. <laughs> so, um, just, See the just those particular ones. Uh, like, in the, what's it called? Uh, Newman's Pride, all of those shots where the character is like looking around or, or shaking his head, which is like actually his whole body. Those, I did those. Um, I'm so proud of the, the scene in uh, the last episode of season two where it is like all the way to her. It was like, too dangerous to live. <laughs> <laughs> too risky. <laughs> <laughs> they like look one or the other way. I'm literally all that is the astronaut is doing the point right emote and then the point left emote, and I've just got it zoomed in enough to where he's like looking one direction, looking the other direction. Yeah, <laughs> we cheat, but like, there's yeah. Bunch to of dirty have cheaters. Certain, to have certain emotions come through, you need to have facial expression, which you can't. There are even like some scenes in season three that we are writing that I've had to be like, I can't do this. I can't, I have to scrap this whole scene because it's totally dependent on emotion being shown and it cannot be shown. We do need more people to send us their voices though. Oh like, yeah. Like seriously guys, audition, please. Please audition. My you, voice is potato. You want to- Your voice is a potato? Could be worse, your voice could be a <laughs> banana. Hello there tomorrow. Would you like well, it? potatoes can be delicious whenever mashed. That was so crazy. You sounded like Scarlet for a second. That was really weird. <laughs> you did. Who, me or who? Yeah, you. you. <laughs> <laughs> who, me? Couldn't be. Then who? I will say though, even with the lack of facial expressions or the faces, sometimes it does allow the person watching to imagine the yes. person how they would see it. Yes. Or how they would see it. Which is another thing, by the way. Uh, if we turned it into another medium, right? Another entertainment medium. Um, whoever we got cast as the different characters would be so very different than what you see and imagine um, watching Deadly Salvage. So, yeah, that would be another thing. Like, and like, for example, Kovabom, his voice as William Nathan is iconic, and that is William Nathan, but he would not be William Nathan if we, because he's not old, he's not an old man. Like, <laughs> so. Ron Perlman. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Woody Harrelson. Oh gosh, no. You don't <laughs> like Woody Harrelson? Nathan. No. I think Ron Perlman would be the best one though. Nathan Fillion. As as Nathan? Yeah. That, that would Adrian. be interesting. I don't know if I've ever seen him play a bad guy. Uh I don't think I have. Maybe it's about time he branched out. <laughs> give, give him a call, Mab. Right, okay. Me and my connections. I have a few, but not that high up. Somebody tweeted Well, you call somebody him. who knows somebody who knows somebody. <laughs> hey, we could always have another writer strike and... <laughs> Mr. Mr. Ho Dr. Hobo. Well, I had... I had a dream one time. <laughs> that um, 
Oh my gosh. Oh, I just blinked on his name. The writer of Firefly. Joss Whedon? Yeah. I had I had a dream one time that Joss Whedon came across uh, Deadly Salvage and liked it. And my world was complete. And I loved everything. And then I woke up <laughs> and I was like, dang it. <laughs> I have dreams that are really awesome, and then I wake up and I'm like, dang it. <laughs> Mine mostly included my maintenance list being ended. It's like, I finally finished repairing that, and that, nope. and that. <laughs> and then I wake up, nope. Did Trevny played by John Cena. <laughs> can't do that because no one will see him. Wow. I could see Tom Hanks as William Aiden. <laughs> no, see, if you had man. Cena as um, Kachevny, he just needs to body slam people. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like in uh, in your bloopers when uh, yeah. he's trying to repair, <laughs> just get body slamming each other. That's fine. We'll use that. <laughs> it's one of my favorite parts in the blue reel because there have been multiple times where it's like we're done. We're we're done. We don't use that take that he says. That's fine. We'll use yeah, that. Yeah, we don't. It's not even close. Yeah. The take we ended up going with. We we tried a different tactic and it looked amazing. After like fifty tries, yeah. none of them were funny. It was just like, and you missed. And I missed, and, we, and I had the wrong camera angle, yep. and I gotta move uh -huh. it again, and I gotta move it again, and I gotta oh, move it again. It takes and such then a just, long okay, time. let's just try it one more time. Swing, bada, bada, smack. <gasps> uh -huh. That looked great. We did it. We yeah. did it. <laughs> We're done. We're not doing anything else today. Yep, that's ridiculous. The amount of time put into filming those things just. Uh, not uh, Adam Baldwin for William Nathan. Hmm, mm. Jane. I don't know. I don't think so. I wouldn't cast him. Michael Dorn is verdict. I'd <laughs> have to, like, as... I don't know. I'd have to Ooh, actually do a casting call. You know what? Call. Brent Spiner would make a good William Nathan. He would, actually. I thought about that alchemy. Um... He was like Nabarine voicing Artemis because all of the fans would not like they'd, it. They'd if rebel. It wasn't but um, I've I have thought about that. There wouldn't be any reason not to cast me because it's just a voice and I have voice acting experience. But and they could pay you nothing, even peanuts. Well, I guess that's true. If I didn't have an agent, and I suppose. But I think I'm gonna get off. Before oh, I okay, fall out of my chair. Okay. <laughs> Sleep well, my friend. <laughs> Good night. May you dream of my right. bananas. <laughs> no. May you, dream. May you dream of peeling bananas all night. No. Peel all of the bananas to bore. All no. the bananas. I have sweet, sweet no. nightmares. <laughs> <laughs> Potassium is good for I'm you. I'm okay with nightmares. <laughs> Have a good night. They I'm mostly just night. involve falling. <laughs> I hate those. I'm fine with those. <laughs> I hate them because it's just, they just won't... Just the ground every five minutes, it's annoying. Right, well, so they've only ever happened to me in Spanish class. Um, <laughs> with my head on the <laughs> desk, and then... <laughs> When you have a falling dream and you're on a desk, you fall. You hit the ground, which is the desk, and it is loud. <laughs> and people go, what just happened? And you're like, I'm cool. It's fine. I didn't just fall to my death and hit the desk. <laughs> 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 yep. <laughs> that doesn't sound too, too bad, but... <laughs> Yeah, the only other nightmare, I, re reoccurring nightmare I have is uh, re-seeing that incident with the motorbike. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which is no fun. I have many, many recurring nightmares because chronic nightmares. Yay! I had a pretty terrible job. Somnia! Yay! Yeah. Were you out of Bananas DE? No, no, I was, it was like, it was, you know how sometimes your dreams are completely not related to reality at all? 
Um, yeah. I was like not married to Nab and I was trying to I don't know. I, I was I was like I was I was the kind of person that I hate. I was like uh I was like seeing one woman and then just being a terrible person around on the other time the whole time I'm screaming my head like no stop it DE stop it what are you doing no neither of these people is your wh what are you stop it <laughs> and, but no control you know it was on rails it was just no fun and, he's I mean, sweet <laughs> I mean I'm sure other people might have thought the dream was fun but uh, he has it's a thing which I'm happy about <laughs> she's happy about my thing yes <laughs> Um, I am, I am, yeah, I am pleased that when, whenever he has dreams where he is not married to me, his subconscious goes, this isn't right, this isn't right, this isn't right, so, um, his subconscious is very much attached to me, so, I am pleased. It was, it was sweet and very sad at the same time. There was one time he woke in the middle of the night and, um, and hugged me tight. And I don't sleep well, and so I was awake for that. And um, I asked him in the morning what that was about, and he said that he had a dream where um, I suddenly was like, I'm sorry, I don't want to be with you anymore. Like and he had been begging me in his dream to not go and it was so sad but at the same time very sweet that he was like you're here you're not leaving and i must hold you because that was awful so <sighs> i'm not sure why that is a thing in his subconscious <laughs> like oh, i'm leaving you forever. hawk she didn't train me to be like this this is something i've done to myself <laughs> My subconscious feels very tangled. Like, a lot of time, it's like I'm seeing or, like, feeling many things at the exact same time. Well, crew, if you stop taking LSD before bed, that'll stop. <laughs> he didn't uh, refute it. He didn't, he didn't deny it. He didn't, he just sort of let that sit there, I guess. <laughs> or... Oh, I just have no clue what LSD actually is. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> it's a it's a it's a very powerful hallucinogenic drug, popular first in the '60s, I think. Blue sea in the sky with diamonds. <laughs> yeah, the only oh. dreams I have lately that I don't like are the there be ones where I'm walking again. <clears throat> it feels so real, and then I'll wake up and it's like, And that crap. would suck, yeah, yeah I'm sorry. Yeah, I see how that would be terrible. How has the therapy been working, though? Have you been Good. able to do anything major? Uh, nothing too, too crazy. Um, <laughs> nothing yeah. too crazy, like, standing. Yeah, not, you know, going skydiving or anything, you know, but, uh... <laughs> but, uh, past couple of weeks we've been doing... So I'm standing in, with the assistance of my therapist. I've been able, like, moving my legs. I've done walking, so... That's a big deal. That's that huge. Is a, that's awesome. Yeah, it is. As somebody yeah. who's told he would walk again, yes, I, I know how you feel about that. Yeah, my therapist always gets on my case. She's like, you're so blasé. Like, you just, <laughs> you don't get anger over stuff. I guess? <laughs> See, there you go again. <laughs> As a, like, as a teacher, I get that. Where it's like, are you kidding? You just did something awesome. Something unlocked and it was incredible and you don't care. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. Yeah. <laughs> Drago, I need mean, magic I... powers. Uh, because Rothic built Ready and Forward according to the... Uh... Okay. Fair enough. Let me know when you've got it. Uh... Um... Hold on. Oh, Dre, I'm going to pull your magic powers away because I forgot I did. I forgot I even had him. Yep. <laughs> during during my first semester of uh, training at the community college, uh, we were doing a lot of things breaks related, and all the guys were like kind of freaking out because I completely disassembled a, a 
drum break, cleaned everything, put it back together, and in the time it took them to get a tire off. Oh no. That's and a problem. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, but yeah, they, they were just like, how'd you do it that fast? Like, I don't know, I just well, did it. But if you have, I mean, if you have experience beforehand, then that's one thing. It's not like me and like my, uh, my just like geometry class is just, how are you doing these things? I don't know, I'm just doing them. Yep, people have knacks well, for things. Well, like, um, I'd never seen that set up for a break, a, a, a drum break before. I have worked on drum breaks. I know how to get tires off just fine, but there are different setups for drum breaks. Never seen one of those before, but still. I just remembered how the mechanism went back together. Which is cool. Yeah. Everybody's talented at different things. Not me, I'm not talented at anything. Okay. <laughs> if you say so. <laughs> Everybody's doing like this. <laughs> I can do a lot of things, but like they're things that are just like easier for me. I mean, like isn't that what I just said? <laughs> Where <laughs> some people are good at some things and other people are good at other things, and it just clicks for some people. Like I'm, mm -hmm. I have a special knack for teaching. I can teach very well, and I cannot explain why. But um. Never yeah, remember what you said earlier. No. Any of us are tired. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yeah. I can think of the exact same things as other people really easily for some reason. I am thrusters are done. Woohoo! Oh yeah, that's good. CIC's got red lights now. Alright, uh, should I disconnect it? Uh. I'd say wait till we get uh, the batteries completed so that you can start charging from yeah. the base. Hello, Smoke James. Hey, Smoke James. Hey, Smoke James. Pause it. I don't even have power anymore. Ship is looking pretty good. Oops. That's very cinematic right there. I'll just ignore all the flashing what? lights and the garish bad dog down at the bottom. <laughs> Ooh, an unknown signal. Pardon me, gentlemen. Something just... What? We just got capped. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> D.E. You need it. You need orange now. You need to be orange now. No, I didn't cap back anyone. <laughs> Whoever <laughs> <was> try <trying. laughs> Whoever cap back someone needs to go change their suit to cap back orange. What do you think I'm Alright, you shouldn't have to be able to kill yourself on your own backpack. <laughs> oh no, you definitely can. I've done that before. So many times. <laughs> Someone get back to themselves. <laughs> Trying my luck to get a special item. Oh boy, a bat! Another badger grinder. Oh boy. I've kind of I've stopped going after the regular ones. I only go after the strong ones. There's a strong one, but it's like 80 kilometers away. I've actually never gotten a strong unknown signal. I think I've only gotten one. Oh, Lancer, I, I'm well aware that my, I only have 602 left. That's why I'm flying back to base at 110 meters a second. <laughs> Finally, mind connecting that up? Sure.
What's up, Nickadoodoo? You are the easiest way for me to get to delicious, delicious oxygen. There are greebles happening. Oh, I love greebles. Put these space credits in. A few more space credits in. So many space credits. Heavy laser dirt. Oh, these are all light laser. Oh man, it's gonna be a brilliant blue light show in the center. Saber. I don't know if three large reactors is gonna be enough for all these weapons. Find out, I guess. How much does a backlog have? Uh, let me check. I can find a kill mark one did salvage. I forgot about that. It's got one, two, three, four. Yeah, let's go. Have a good rest of your night, everybody. <laughs> good night, Tabor. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I think this will be a support craft for the bad dog. Are you kidding me? This thing's he oh. more heavily armed than the bad dog is. Well, the about dog has more shield power, I think. Well, you got plenty of room to cram more reactors in here if you want. True. Could add one to the front. You would not think this is possible, but we went through all 500,000 K of- I knew we would. Of iron. I believe it. I believe yeah. it. We actually had two on the front. Oh no, I'm not going. A little bit. I don't know what I'll do. Oh, and... It's not what I want to build. I want to build this thing. Thank you. Ugh. No, Dre had the exact same idea I did. What? What? I was just gonna go grab a big load of stone. Uh, just place two reactors at the front. <laughs> yeah, I was actually about to go to the iron depositing, get some pure. I could do that, yeah. I'll go with you dry if you want to do that. Well, once I yeah, that'd be I'll good. Dump a big load of stone here. Just give it some something to do, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Lancer, I was talking to a single block that wasn't letting me weld because these turrets get in the way of wherever it is that you're trying to build. So I had to maneuver in order to weld the block. I can see why you guys are able to get so much stone in one go. There's so much materials in one go. I haven't even filled a single cargo container yet. I already almost had a million stone. Wow. 
Wow. Wow. Wow. Wow. Just a distant walk of wow. <laughs> wow. That was pretty close. Alerta, alerta. Alerta. <laughs> Oh, she's a fat beast. Yeah, she's horrible on her handling. Pretty good when empty, but full up, it's... There's small skills. Metal grid. Metal grid. Solid? Ow, oh, thank you, baby. A blade. Okay, there's a million stone in here. I'm gonna dump this real quick. He wants you to join our club, kid. Oh. Too many, but whatever. Why is it called the duck? I uh, think Epic Duck made it. Ah. Uh, yeah, go to your left. Good. Come up. Come up. Good. Good. Uh, down just a touch. When I up, down, touch the ground, puts me in the mood. Up, down, touch the ground, in the mood for food. I mean, yes? I am stout, round, and I have found, speaking poundage-wise. Wait, what the heck? I improve my appetite when I exercise. And pull the stone out. Yeah, you gotta get it a little bit. Needs to sing that better in a Winnie the Pooh voice. Up, down, up. I can't do. I can't do. <laughs> can't do a Sterling Holloway. Eh? No. He has such a fantastic voice. Where did it all go? It's in all the refineries. Oh, there's a bunch of it right there. Okay. There's a bunch of it right there, too. Okay. No way. So far, 25. Stick this on the uh, wagon bucket. Got half an hour. Is that enough time? Yeah. I'll just go basically bore into the thing and grab as much as I can. So, what do you think we'll be able to finish this thing by next next week? I think so. It's looking pretty good so far. What have I done wrong? It's all gone wrong.
Okay, and if the dampers are off, should be good. Action. See you later, Death. Get out of here, Death. You want company, Jirai? Sure. Okay, I'm in one of the miners at back. All right, jumping. We only got 1,000 metal bricks. How are we doing on cobalt? Should have plenty. Should. Yeah, a little over half an hour left in the stream, so try to stay awake now. Okay. I promise I will make it worth your while. Okay. Still safe. Stay awake, D. <laughs> 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 We are all tired. We are. Oops. Not card stale tubes. Large stale tubes. There are no more large stale tubes. <laughs> you gotta make more. There's some more eight people trying, trying to be extremely productive while also being extremely tired. I think. We are succeeding in being productive computers. I think we're also succeeding in being tired. Very tired. There we go. Ah, eons are contagious. <laughs> Lancer. Uh, found the Australian. I don't know if you've ever watched the Muppet movie, but uh, the OH Games, um, his tired, I'm not, I'm wide awake, face plants into desk. That reminds me of the Muppet movie. Um, Fozzie and Kermit have been riding along, moving right along um, for a long time and they finally pull in and they're stopped for a little bit and um Kermit's like oh yeah it's tired you know whatever it's been a long drive and Fozzie's like I'm wide awake and then he falls backward into his seat and starts snoring and that's what you reminded me of and it made me happy because I love that show I like the Muppets a lot my eyes are just now getting droopy. <laughs> you final uh, back out of that one. Okay. Yeah, the one I went for, they had a, only a small amount. I feel like I need to sing a lullaby to everybody. It's possible. It's possible. <laughs> <laughs> Go, go, gadget, Nabarine. <laughs> remember that one time? I actually did sing a lullaby to the crew. I do remember that one time. Whoop. The pressurized volume of the ship is not going to be great. Thank you, Severed Limbs. Good to see you. Good night, Severed. Construction components now. Alright. You wanna fight about it? Hmm. We seriously have our again. I'm so confused. No, I'm not at I'm about to run low on steel plates. Wow. 
Did it really eat through all that iron? One over a million stone is gone. There, everything is used. Wow, that's amazing. Godzilla Lover 101. What is the new game that you have received? That is a fun game. That's obviously Goat Simulator. That's why I said he goat in a game. <laughs> obviously. Looks like the outer hull of this thing's actually done. It just needs its weapons and placements and shields. And of course, everything needs to get piped up on the inside. There's a couple things that aren't piped up properly. It's close, but yeah, not quite. Looks like all the ion thrusters are done too. Impressive. Most impressive. Battle Star Galactica Deadlock, he says. Let's try that here. Oops. Oops. Vent in there. Deadlock's pretty fun. Little hums and abs, you sound happy. I'm singing a little bit to myself because now it's stuck in my head. Because you're sleepy. Uh, it's also uh, just the one we actually done. It's also just a pretty song. Did you leave your. I think you left your creative mode tools on. There you go. And they should automatically not. deactivate once he gets demoted. Yeah, I wasn't demoted, but I was off. I know that. I had it off. Demoted. I, just demoted. I was gone for. I was gone for like five seconds, and the entire reactor just got finished. He's he efficient. <laughs> I've got the biggest, the best welder, and I had. To, I've been. Loading this thing in with uh, freaking reactor components. It's possible we did build a lot. I built like 5,700 reactor components at the beginning of the stream. Energy low. Didn't get me this time. No, I, I'm about to. The personal batteries, even with my nap, uh, this full looks sleep on. Yeah. Well, Energy. Uh, critical. Go take a nap. Feel free to take one. Take a sleep. It's good to take sleeps. A single sleep. Well, he said sleeps. So. I love sleeps. Yep. When I get them, I like them. And they elude me. I hate them. Same. <laughs> I will never need to get. Okay, never. Not. I won't say never, but we won't need to get iron for a long time. <laughs> okay. How much is it yet? I have almost two thousand thousand. Two thousand thousand. I like that. Yeah. Two two thousand k. I'm logging off. <laughs> right, yeah. They can't make it. Bye. I can't shake them. <laughs> the Sandman's in my eyes. No! Mr. Sandman, bring me a dream. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> do, 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 get the sweetest. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> I can't sing anymore. Okay. All the <laughs> 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 
very addictive. Can't withdraw construction comps. All right, construction comps. You can. You. All right then. Keep your components. All right, final. Let's dock up and head. Oh, we're being yep. asked if we have a mod list. It gets it changes so often. This also that's a question we get a lot with Deadly Salvage as well. Um, it changes so often that a mod list is kind of like impossible. But I'm seeing if I have a certain mod installed. Nope, I don't have the mod installed. Can we give him a basic like the ones that we always use? We always have rail guns. Yeah, railguns, uh, shields, the directed shields, energy right? weapons, um, mech packs, mech packs, armored conveyors. Oh, mech packs is back. I remember it borking, and so we got rid of it for a long yeah, time. Yeah, it works again. At least till the next update. <laughs> At least until then. Coming from a keen near you. That's right, I should probably put a gravity generator. There are so many guns, so many guns, so many guns. Tra la la la. Thank you, Drago. Good night. Thanks, Drago. Uh, do we have any console mods? Um, I don't think I have a console mod. This is a this is a DLC. And that's Drago, which you already thanked. This is the thing I hate about the skin one where it says Ahoy S-E Be prepared to experience some super clangy journey on the keyboards instead of just putting a QWERTY keyboard like a normal human being. He left you an easter egg? No. No, th that's, uh, th this is a keen console. Oh. 0.71 iron ingots at base. They're docking up. They're docking up a lot more iron. Your, uh, your dreadnought here, your little mini dreadnought, is definitely sucking up the resources. It really be like. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> that noise! <laughs> that noise, exactly, that one. Uh, yeah, one? Wallabies! You got wallabies in your vegetable. <laughs> That's so alien to me. Oh, there is. Yeah, space bars consoles. I have those. Yeah, we got space bars consoles. Uh, Dark star shields. Dark energy weapon. The decorative packs. Uh, and then oh, uh, the landing gear. Retractable landing gear. Put the, the crybaby back on this thing. Crybaby that did absolutely no good. Yeah. Crybaby cry, make your mama sigh. Oh man, this ship is so sluggish. We well, called this thing the starfish crew, but I really think it's more of a sunfish. I was right, he went to, he left, he went to sleep. Yes. <laughs> oh no, he's still here. Oh. No, I'm still here. There's so many people leaving. <laughs> that was bizarre. I just watched that turn around very quickly. Oh yeah, it's 
This is a deadly little ship he's got here. Good heavens. Crew has a gift for small grid ships. I think that it should be called the urchin. The urchin? It looks like an urchin. That seems like a rather urchin name change. Ah. Lots of gyros indeed, EOD. How many gyros does the big ship have that we're building? The not Nickapoo. Uh, four, right, four right now. Four? Oh my gosh, we're gonna need like a hundred. It's not that massive. Uh, it isn't now, but when we load it full of ammunition. Are there any plates? Whoops. There's some plates. I love computer. Hello, computer. Here. Keyboard, how quaint. I'm just putting a bunch of uh, gyros on top of the CIC. So if anybody shoots it from the top, it's going to be a lot harder to get in. Gyro, I should do the trick. This, the inside of the ship already makes a lot more sense than the nigga they do. <laughs> Most ships make more sense than the nigga they do. That's, that's fair. Why do you have slopes inside? What do you mean? Like, these, these things. They put a blurry system. Rebels. Yeah, but to where? To what? To why? To who? Why? To whom? Why isn't? Why isn't your ship a giant brick with no curves or angles on the outside with guns pasted all over it? Because it looks uh, because better this way. It looks like on the color. outside. That's where you're mostly going to be looking f uh, at. Okay, so whenever crew, you're crew, if you come over here. Actually, wait, yes. I have to go get oxygen because I'm dying. Um, so hold that thought. BRB dying. Why does it ever say oxygen low? Uh, because they want to see you it suffocate. It says energy low, but it never says oxygen low. <laughs> yes, Lance is with me. Greebles do not need a where or why. But... So, if you come over here, you'll notice that directly below my Greebles is the medical bay. And if there's one thing I know about when we fight, it's we spend a lot of the time popping out of the medical bay. So this area is going to look nice. <laughs> so darn it, it looks pretty. And darn it, and, and doggone it, people like me. <laughs> Could have at least added a good light. I haven't gotten there yet. We can put lights on these blocks. We can put lights here. We can put lights up there. Aye. Whole section of stuff that we haven't done yet. Because this is all going to get kind of sealed in a little bit. Mm -hmm. Lights there. Lights over there. Mm -hmm. Like right now, there's uh, the spotlights are shining through the ship because spotlights are funny like that. They cast shadows, but also they don't. Their face cast shadows. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do with this. We okay, like the wooden interior as well. <laughs> it's the wood that makes it good. <laughs> Yay! Uh, you know what, Lancer? I'm just going to show you something real quick, so you don't feel so smug! Look at that! Plumbed for atmosphere. 
so yeah. No wonder you have wallabies in your garden. It requires just plates. I guess the people who haven't watched my streams don't understand what you just said, and it could sound very strange out of it's context. It's the wood that makes it good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he says. <laughs> yep. Um, so if you are not, if you don't watch my streams on Twitch, um, every Tuesday my time, Tuesday, Tuesday daytime, <laughs> or nighttime my time, ah, whatever, um, I play with my sisters on my Twitch, and we have been playing with the community um, some Darwin Project, which is a free game on Steam, and that is something that is said when um, the resource of wood is gifted to a player by somebody. That she says that, so that's what he's saying. <laughs> Fully docked up. Iron is being. Huzzah! Mm -hmm. Praise be to Clang! Now to go through all the refineries and get the stone out the way for. The, uh, the wagon bucket has definitely proved its worth over and over and over again. Yay! <laughs> so much iron. I still love my trashy screen. Yeah. Um. This account, which I will put in the comments. Hmm. Well, that's the original Nav Knights channel if you link to that. And that's where we started, was on that other YouTube channel. But we have since moved to my Twitch. Yes. Twitchy. Twitchy channel. Yes. I will link our channels. I did put out a thing today on Ball and Chain Gaming with links. In our, if you go to the community tab on our YouTube page, uh, there are links to both. Both? Okay. Uh, yeah, to both of our Twitches. The link is literally the Nab Knight's name, um, which you should be able to click on. But if you can't, that's, uh, that's new. You used to be able to just click on profiles like that. So I won't even bother giving you that one because it doesn't matter anymore. I will... I'll just do this. Well, I'll just do it. So much space station. We have so much space station. It's not a link, EOD. Just click on the Nab Knight's name. Yeah, that's that what account. I was saying, but it doesn't, it doesn't seem to do that anymore. Because I couldn't oh. even click on it. Well, I, I wouldn't want to click on it anyway. It's a uh -huh. dead YouTube channel. Um, then this is DE's, but yeah, the, the account that I'm using, the Nab Knights account in the YouTube chat right now is where we started as my sisters and I started on a YouTube channel, which is the one linking to our Twitch channels. We just moved because all we ever did was stream, and so it didn't make any sense to have YouTube stuff. <laughs> Dead YouTube channels are anthropology. Every once in a while, I will post something there. Um, I'll have to make like a highlight uh, reel or something. Crew. By doing all this, what? you've made it impossible to pipe this inside for air. I'm just gonna make a small air thing in there. What do you mean it's impossible? Nothing's impossible. Yeah, until we take some fire, and then we gotta hunt for the whole ship to try and figure out where the leak is in the outer hall. Okay. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. And I was like, yeah, whatever. Because this is my United, United States, States of whatever. whatever. 
I see you are uh, enjoying that deco pack too, though. Shouldn't there be a walkway to the airlock over here? Uh, it can be done through up here. No, but like, right... These... Okay, no, it, it's, it was your plan to do anyway, so I'm just gonna... Drago! Go to sleep! Go to sleep, Drago! <laughs> Don't stay up, up until 2 a.m., okay? I like how that's still recurring. I know. Poor Alice. <laughs> What's even funnier is he, he just totally ignores that. He's like, no, they're just going to be that. Yep, they're just going to keep going. I haven't seen Alice in a while. Whatever happened to that kid? Yeah, he he's hanging out in BBs a lot. So. Okay, that's fine. BB can have him. <laughs> he stays up till 2 a.m. all the time. Gosh, what a punk. What a punk. <laughs> Those of you guys not knowing what we're talking about, there are a lot of inside jokes, not just from our channel, but from our Discord as well, so. He he told the entire Discord channel uh, to remind him not to stay up until 2 a.m., and it started immediately. Hey, hey, Ellis, don't stay up until 2 a.m., okay? <laughs> and then it mixes with other memes, like, oh uh, The Moon's Haunted. The Moon's Haunted. Ellis is Haunted. <laughs> don't, don't don't go to the don't stay on the moon until two a.m. Okay, <laughs> Just all sorts of stuff. I had to walk way right over here. Yay! It's a walkway over here. There's a walkway over here too. But there's one over here. Yeah. Ooh. I added a fifth hydrogen tank there. Store some more hydrogen for the ship. Cool. Cause I know we have a ton of ice still sitting in the energy state. low. But if I go down here, and now my energy is low anymore. <laughs> Do we have oxygen tanks on this beast? We're gonna need to get some of those. Uh, yeah. Uh, those we should probably add some assemblers as well. Yeah. Doesn't need refineries or anything, but assemblers are always good to have. Be able to break down salvage. And you've got large car containers off to the other side, right? Oh no, they're down there. Ah! Ah! I grabbed the wrong thing. It's like the Nickadoodoo's angry older brother. What's a bigger, angrier <laughs> cookie than a Snickerdoodle? <laughs> An angrier cookie, I don't know. The the gingerbread man? A ginger snap. Oh yeah, ginger snap. We need to get our youngest. So what do we paint it brown? No, because it'll just look like the a hermit. <laughs> the hermit? Oh my gosh, Scarlet's still with us. Yes, he's he's been hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm surprised the couch hasn't claimed it. I know, yet. right? <laughs> Power cells, superconductors, and motors. We could call it a Simnim roll. Simnim roll. Simnim. Simnim roll. I'll just call it Simnim. The Simnim. Simnim. I like Simnim. <laughs> Much iron. <laughs> there is still 500k on the uh, miner. Oh, don't worry. We'll start using it. Here, let me start. I mean, the priority steel plates building like crazy. I mean, we have like five minutes. Yeah. It's time to go very soon, so start wrapping things up. We need to get to bed on time. <laughs> oh man, this thing is looking angrier and angrier by the minute. Good night, Godzilla. Good night, Godzilla. Walnut chocolate chip cookies. Hmm. One with nuts. <laughs> Macadamia. 
<laughs> His name or macadamia. <laughs> Simnim is good though. Keeping with the theme of our ships. Nickadoodoo and Simnim. I remember it's just the outcast, the bad dog. <laughs> The bad dog is something different, but bad dog is less of a battleship and more of a fire support ship because, my gosh, that heavy laser. Macadacaanium. <laughs> Macadaca. <laughs> <laughs> Macadaca is amazing. You're cute, Lancer. Almost time to go look at lesser channels for entertainment. <laughs> oh, I don't know about lesser channels. I do love how you uh, you staggered the the weapons here so they can fire over each other up front. I f didn't see this. More one. firepower. More Daka. Yes, more superconductors. Okay, well, let's produce some superconductors then. There's a shield buster on the front, but I don't think we're ever going to be able to use it effectively. Um, it's still good to have. Yeah, j just like a, a last minute, j just to take it down. Well, can you imagine, like, the shields buzz, 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 like all the shields are transferring back and forth. You get in close, you nail them with a shield buster, and those light lasers just go to work. Yeah. I've been on the receiving end of something very similar to that, so... Just tilt the ship like 45 degrees to the target and then you have like the entirety of it. Yeah, I mean, or you could, you could even, uh... Is this a heavy laser on the bottom? Yeah. And that was a triple light laser. Oh my gosh. So many light lasers. They're cheap, I guess. You may even manage to tuck one into here. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, it's clipping into the ship, unfortunately. Oh, well. I'm good at cramming things into places. <laughs> I can tell. Triple forward firing railguns is pretty scary, too. Also gives some, uh, some side people uh, to be able to do something. And these uh, front battleship cannons will be good to get this armor. Yeah. Especially with like the Formix and their like free layers of heavy armor. Do yeah, the Formix will just start calling us demons? <laughs> are they are ready? No, they call us spicy food. Weld some catwalks before I can get out of here. Mm, the catwalk. Mm, the cat I'm too sexy for my ship. Too sexy <laughs> for my ship. <laughs> 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 this hot table keeps getting in my way. The other things that I needed, I don't remember. I'll figure it out as soon as I go back over here. Need superconductors. We got made. a bunch queued up. Construction good bonus is what I always forget. You don't have any construction components. I'm grabbing another sampler and telling you. I it. hope not. We're building a bunch now. Ah! Remember, we're out of iron for a while, so. Thing that happens. Oh, yeah, so now this thing has like five react uh, large reactors now. It's very scary. You know, the only reason Scarlet is still here is so we can listen to us build this thing and can discern weaknesses for the That's right. ships to take advantage of. 
I don't Fox. think he's even awake. He's here. He just said something not too long yeah, ago. Yeah, he said something not long ago. Could be in and out, though. Um, Hawk says, I hope this one makes it on the workshop. We keep saying we're going to put things on the workshop, and then well, they don't end they up could on do the workshop. They could do it under the workshop. And then, weren't you trying to put something on the workshop, and it just wasn't yeah, I'm, working? Yeah, I managed to get it to work. That was something for uh, Splitsy's uh, Assertive Cargo Ships mod. Ah. I thought we, like, we put some on the workshop once they die or, like, have been used long enough. Well, Nikadudu made it because Nikadudu was just the ship from last season. And it's just still here. Yeah. Uh, friends, the time has come, the walrus said. Talk of other things, like sleep and uh, dreams. Right. Everyone to your beds aboard the Nikadudu! To the sleeping chamber to the sleeping chamber Nabarine report to the bedroom all right here i go do 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 look at all those sleepy people down there i still love this main space in here in the nicodudu Remember whenever, like, this was, like, the end of the, uh, rover? Yeah. Whenever it was a rover? Yeah, back when it was a rover, this so was long ago. the very back part. What is, what is going on here? What the? Oh, let me paint it. What are you doing? There's a random block that's not painted properly. Okay, guys. This has been fun, as always, and uh, I'm glad you guys stuck out watching with us. It's uh, it's always uh, interesting staying up this late, although we are getting a substantial Australian crowd right? for some reason. I have no idea why. D.E., do you like my new uh, title? Express Nab. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Express Nab, right next to the directed energy. Um, you're welcome, Lancer. Anyway, guys, thanks for thanks for playing with us tonight. Thanks for watching. Thanks for those of you who donated, and thanks to those of you who didn't donate but <laughs> spend your time here, because time is just as valuable. Um, we always have lots and lots and lots of fun with this, and I'm glad to have done it. And with that, you can look at a beautiful picture of the Nicodudu getting skewered by a super laser. Perhaps it is foreshadowing. I don't know. Anyway, good night, good night. guys. <laughs>